Everybody, this is Kagato, and I am the final boss, and welcome to Persona 5 Strikers, the official sequel to the vanilla version of the game. That is why I wanted to do this right after I finished up the vanilla version of the game, and not wait to do it after I did Royal. So, this is a different kind of game. I know you all know all about this, but yeah. This is more of a Dynasty Warriors type of game and not the traditional JRPG thing, which is fine because I need a bit of an RPG break. So I can continue playing Persona and not have an RPG to go through for four years or more. <laughs> but still, it's a brand new game, a brand new adventure, and quite frankly, I was looking forward to this. <laughs> Let's go! The pussy wagon has been rebuilt. It's time. Persona 5 Strikers allows for you to experience the game with English or Japanese voices. Of course, we are going the English. Downloadable content. Persona 1 music set found. 
New songs have been unlocked for Battle BGM. This is something I love. Uh, for whatever reason, it was in Persona 3. But it never came back. Having different kinds of music that you can have in either the dungeon or in battles. Well, Persona 3 was in the dungeon. Here, it's battles. You can actually have different fight music. Not just the default one. And you can put it on random. So every time you engage in a fight, it can be a new song. So, a new song! Oh, I'm so excited! I'm crying in my voice! Oh. Persona 3, Last Destruction! Persona 4! And of course, we have ourselves the uh, classic Persona 5 ones. And I got a whole bunch of other goodies. You can only play this version if you got the Deluxe Edition. The Deluxe Edition essentially gives you uh, early access as well as soundtrack, art book, and behind the scenes for an extra 10 bucks. So I figured, eh, why not? I'll, I'll, I'll pay the extra 10 bucks to play this early. Yes! So far, everything seems to be doing okay. Nothing has broken yet, except for my voice. <laughs> and because seven, no option to do uh, both and have English voices. No, <laughs> no English voices. <laughs> that that would be a hell of something, wouldn't it? So, oh boy, it's gonna be great. I am playing the uh, the PlayStation Four version. Because I figured I'd have some consistency. Originally, I thought about getting it on the Switch. Just so I could support Shin Megami Tensei games on the Switch. But, Persona 4... Or, PlayStation 4 has better frame rate. Crystario, welcome to boss! Diorio. Excuse me, I'm gonna borrow this for a second. <laughs> I thought he crash landed with it. <laughs> Alpha Dragon and Kento, thank you so much, both of you. Lone player for Persona Uno is on here, and I have it on both. Oh, here we go. Yeah! <laughs> All right, let's begin the operation. All right, tutorial mission, tutorial fight! Goro catches here, Maple! That was one hell of an entrance, Joker. They're all riled up. Just keep <laughs> at it. Go ham until you get the last bit of attention. Well, you heard her. Futaba says to go ham. Let's see. Oh, I'm already in it. There's no tutorial. Let's just get in there! Yeah! <laughs> I'm sorry, Pixies didn't mean to hurt you that badly. <laughs> Woo uh oh. Let's see. Uh, Dream Beetle. Woohoo! Ah, oh, yeah! Let's see, gun? Ooh, so, special attack, standard attack. Uh,. Bang, 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 bang. Oh, well, not, not very fast. Bang, 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 bang. All right, all right, I'll do the thing. I'll do the thing. Woohoo! Look how beautiful we are. Show's over. <laughs> Wait, we're done already? No, 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 no! I want to be, no! I want to fight more! No! Oh. Well, I'll fight more later. Andrew Fowler, thank you so much, dude. I am the masochistic moron who bought all three versions. You bought all versions of Strikers. Holy crap. Alpha Dragon unleashed the destruction. Thank you so much.
Hey, hey. I'm looking forward to this. GG Gerard, thank you so much. Is this a 100% run? I don't know. Do I get something for 100 percent this? Uh, I'm going to just say maybe. I don't know. Hey, it's been a while. It only feels like that because you always forget to reply our texts. Wait, really? I mean, I've just got a lot of stuff to do. I suppose it's been a while for me too, hasn't it? For me as well. I had no money, so I lost service. Oh no! Yusuke, get, get a job! Get a job, you bum! Sell your art or something! How is everyone? I'd say I'm doing well. It's quite late, though. Shouldn't you all be studying for finals? Nah, I'm fine. Unlike Ryuji. Stop, stop! I'm already dead! Anyway, here's what I really wanted to say. Since it's almost summer vacation, why don't we get together? Not a bad idea. Yeah, you guys want to go on a trip? Well, road trip! That sounds like fun. Perhaps Kyoto? That would be a nice place for a vacation. No way! Kyoto trips are for high schoolers! Sweet! We should get together and somewhere and plan this out. Oh, hmm, I wonder where. Where at? Hmm, I wonder! Where else? The hideout. Roger that, leader. <laughs> a certain police wait and next on the agenda is the series of incidents involving unusual behavior in public hmm. first we have the vice minister of finance as you're all aware he had some sort of episode during a diet session q a and abruptly confessed to document tampering so wait 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 that sounds like something that... Hold on, I gotta grab my drink back here. That sounds... If he probably confessed to something, that sounds like Phantom Thieves work, but we're... We don't have access to the metaverse technically at this part of the game. What? Hmm. Urgh. Soon after that, three Sapporo Central Councilmen confessed to bribery and publicly resigned. Yeah, this is totally like Phantom Thieves work, but have we not have... Wait, have we been able to do stuff? I, I don't think we've been able to. Next, the well-known author, Mr. S. He held a press conference and announced he was retiring from writing, returning his book's awards, and deeming his body of work garbage. Garbage, human garbage. Then a newscaster suddenly got down on one knee, confessed his love for his co-anchor on live TV, proposed to her, and got shot down. Shit, dude, that sucks. Lastly, the Director General of Criminal Affairs unexpectedly stripped off his clothing and ran around HQ until successful. <laughs> <laughs> nope, I don't think that's, uh... I don't think that's fan thieves work. That's just fucking hilarious anyway. Nick Howarth, welcome to Boss, dude! <laughs> <laughs> I I don't know who this guy is. I don't know his name yet. I know he's a detective. The fact that he'll laugh at that while everyone else is being serious. I like this guy already. I like this dude. Something amusing to you, Inspector Hasegawa? Oh, nothing. Just your face. <laughs> I'm fired now, aren't I? Uh, no. Excuse me. You know, just nothing except the whole naked running around part. <laughs> <clears throat> the vast majority of these cases have been interpreted as nothing more than bizarre outbursts. But, time and again, every instance involves a sudden change in personality. Furthermore, none of the individuals involved had any known psychological issues before their incidents. Therefore, we can surmise that these cases are the result of an external influence. Mm, I'm surprised that nobody's brought up that these incidents are very familiar to what's been happening before. Aren't these just coincidences? Are you really implying someone out there is using mind control? Okay, yeah. Did the fan thieves just wipe off the face of the earth because what the hell is going on? The cases I listed are only a small sample of this behavior. 
which appears to be happening across the entire nation. Hmm. Sounds like the Phantom Thieves to me. Ah, there we go! There we go! I want silence! Proceed with the report. All right, Captain Buzzkill! Thank you, Commissioner. As Look. you've realized, or at least as one of you realized, these cases are very reminiscent of last year's change of heart epidemic. The top brass have concluded that this is indeed the work of the Phantom Thieves. Shock it! All the Phantom Thieves are at it again! Arrest them! <laughs> we saved the world already! Stop being dicks! Why is everyone continuously being a dick in this game? In the series. <laughs> what? Hmm. You gotta remember this is technically a new game. But what evidence is there? No one's even established a pattern. And we don't have any sort of motive. So far, doing it for kicks is the only thing that'd explain it. Yeah, true. Have any of those people been, I don't know, assholes that needed their hearts changed? You will investigate each of these incidents yourselves as quickly as possible. What I expect from each of you are two things. One, to assemble enough evidence for a successful case. Two, to do so as quickly as humanly possible. Oh, I bet you're just a thrill at parties. The higher-ups are hell-bent on closing this case. I do not know why. It does not matter. All that matters is producing results. Results! Numbers! Progress! I don't care about morality! Fuck that! I was born with a stick up my ass! Give me my results! <laughs> Your suspect is the leader of the Phantom Thief. Oh shit, that's right, they know who I am! Oh god! Uh oh! 11th star, thank you, Hick. I'm gonna congrats on Persona, on, uh, Persona bleh, P5S. I'll send you some celebration pancakes later tonight. I know you love those. Levy, I will murder you. <laughs> Show me a thorough investigation of his entire life. Oh, God. Leave me alone. I just want to live my life. <sighs> Why won't the police just leave me alone? So, the Phantom Thieves rise again. And I'm not even aware of it yet. And I'm supposed to be the leader. Have you guys been doing shit behind my back? I thought the meta now was gone. Guys! It's been a while since we rode this to Young and Jaya, huh? Now for today's train news. Today's headlines are... Plot Convenience News presents Confession of a Document Tampering. The Diet is in chaos over the Vice Minister's and Finance's confession, and the power struggles have flared. Members of the Vice Minister's party have refused to comment across the board while the country awaits his court summons. Remember, this is very important stuff, otherwise it wouldn't be in the game. Pay attention. In business news, fledgling RT company Mini reported record first quarter profits at a conference earlier today. Mini earnings have exploded largely in part of their new virtual assistants, which, if stocks are any indication, is gaining fair and fast. We're almost there. We haven't seen everyone in so long. I know it's stupid, but I'm getting kind of nervous. Wait, my voice volume needs to go up? My voice, okay. My voice volume apparently needs to go up. All right. <laughs> I can't get it much higher than that. Well, I guess I can, but I'd be blowing out your eardrums. How about I turn the game down slightly? How about that? I'll turn the game down ever so slightly. We'll, we'll, we'll work it. We'll work it with that. We'll work it with that. Yes, raise the voice volume. It needs to be higher. How about that? Is that good? <laughs> I. Oh God! <laughs> The Glass Thank you so much, dude! Thank you so much, dude! Thank you so much, dude! Holy shit! Ah! Oh, game! 
Oh, no game. Turn game back up. Oh. Oh, game back up. Okay, game will go up instead. All right. All right, hold on. When you said voice, I thought you were talking about mine. Oh, God. See, there's a difference between game voice and my voice. So if you need the game volume to go up, say, can you increase game volume? If you want my voice to go up, say, increase voice volume. Ah! Oh, my God. I just blew out everyone's eardrums because people in the chat asked me to turn up voice volume. Ah! Well, and, oh, you finally made it. and the thumbs down is going higher and higher. Ah, oh, we're back. Hey. Ah, young and Jaya. We may have been gone for only half a year, but it sure brings back memories. Okay, let's go to LeBlanc post haste. I wonder how the Chief's been getting along. Important location icons. Is everything fine now? Is my voice compared to the game voices okay? Is everything fine? What'd you say, Kagana? My eardrums are too damaged to hear you. <laughs> oh, well, uh... <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> oh, God, here we go again. Why can't, why can't I ever have the volume levels perfect all the time? Hmm. Here we go! <sighs> Nobody here, of course. I've only just gone clear across the country. Nobody here to greet me? Three. Welcome home. Welcome home. <laughs> you guys! Surprise! We get you or what? I figured this was coming. <laughs> we missed ya. Yay! It's been a while. Come on! Can somebody Did else help me out of the Ryuji? <laughs> Looks like you've been doing fine. Too, there are three sets of boobs yeah. in front of me. Can I get hugged by one of them? Coffee, Dad! <laughs> Boy, were you surprised. You guys did all that for us? <laughs> Talk about a greeting. Yay, I feel important. <laughs> we hadn't seen you in so long, we knew we had to do something. I figured the best way to get you was to have Boss let us in early. Well, you're looking sharp. Okay. Makoto's a wet blanket when it comes to her personality, but boy, oh boy, does she know how to dress. She's looking nice. Did you get older? <laughs> on second thought, maybe the only thing that grew on you was your mouth. <laughs> Where I come from, we greet all of our elders like they're old pieces of shit. Didn't you know? But that just means we love them even more. JG Gerard, thank you so much. Who, who, uh, wait, so who has the best new appearance of the group? Um. I, I, I gotta say Makoto. I, I dig the leather. I dig that. <laughs> Joe! Joe! God damn it! Now I'm on the floor! Come on, guys! I've just started up. Oh, you know what? I have something. I have... I, I'm i actually sitting on a blanket. I can actually pull the blanket towards me and bring the controller to me. Ah! I got the controller! And I'm still on the floor! I can still play! Ah! Shit! What? Ah! Ah! <laughs> ah! No! No! I dropped my controller! I dropped my controller! I dropped my controller! No! 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 I can't reach it! No! No! How dare you! How dare you do that to me! 
How dare you do that to me? Why? Why you do that? Why you guys do? Why? Ah! Okay, I got a controller. I got a controller. I got it. I got it. I got it. I'm coming back. I'm coming back. I'm coming back. Come back. I can't go. Yeah, yes. Come. I know. Yes. Yes. I'm back. I'm back. What the hell is wrong with you people? What the hell is wrong with you people? What is wrong with you? Ah! Uh, I'm sure you all have plenty of catching up to do. Not to say thank. Uh, well, not to say thank you, but thank you. Thank you. Yes, thank you. Thank you, thank you all. Thank you all very much. But I gotta and open up. In that up. case, <laughs> go ahead and take it upstairs. Oh, catch I like to order delivery. Oh, catch <laughs> We have enough pancakes at home. After all, it's your room. We have, have enough a good pancakes. time. We can take the pancakes and put them in a waffle iron. Now they're waffles. <laughs> can that work? Can you actually take, I mean, you can take pancake batter, but what if you take an actual pancake and put it in a waffle iron? What you got? Thank you, boss. No problem. You can just pay me back working. Oh, out. good grief. Eric Hackney. <laughs> oh, God, you guys. Ah! You're goddamn right. Kagano, uh, Makoto is in black leather. Looks sexy as heck. Also, Bun wants to join in a call so she can provide the female. Oh. Uh, the JD. Your screams of pain are making me die of laughter. Well, great. Um... I'll talk to Bun later about that. Deal. Now, thieves, to the hideout. To the hideout. <laughs> Great. Just when I was enjoying the peace and quiet. <laughs> Seriously, though, it's Freaking not a joke. Never fails to display. You really never change. <laughs> you formed with me in my final in one day, too. I'm always freaking out. You flunked three finals. Oh God. Uh, Ryuji, you're gonna be held back another year. I had so many makeup lectures in a row, I almost wasn't able to come over today. Oh, you got makeup lectures. Lucky way out. If I failed anything in school, it'd be like, nope, you're held back a year, try again. <laughs> then I win. I only flunked one final. You two are the same as always. Can't you at least take your classes a bit more seriously? Ooh, watch out! Miss President's gonna unleash her fist of justice. Oh, God. Jeez. Can you please forget about that already? So is college life all it's cracked up to be? Oh, that's right! They're in college now. Yes, it's going well. I've been using the time to take care of the core curriculum. I've been busy too, but it's also a lot of fun. For example, I've learned how to selectively breed certain vegetables. Oh, yielded any results yet? <laughs> that caught Yusuke's interest really quick. It's like, food? You has food? Can I ask food? Boy, <laughs> that got his interest. Wait, aren't you in the management program, though? Yes, but students are allowed to take courses beyond their own programs if they feel so inclined. They even offer agricultural science courses. You can learn all sorts of neat things, like the correlation between soil nutrients and yield. Gah. That'd put me to sleep in a minute flat. Good, you could go to bed for once. And you, Fataba? How's school been for you? <laughs> Too easy. At this point, the only hellish parts are the commute and PE. Good job, Fujibaba. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Praise me more. Keep it coming. <laughs> Well, I give you head pats, but I don't exactly have elastic arms, so, uh, good job. Well, how about you then? You're the one we're most curious about. You doing okay back home? Um, uh, yeah, it's very nice. I missed you. What a kawinky dink! Me too. Well, I've been getting by too, but without you around, it's sort of like stuff is just kind of bleh. <laughs> Of course, he's our leader. It's only natural. That's right. Oh, I'm blushing here. 
guys are so nice. <laughs> Once a phantom thief, always a phantom thief. That's so nice to me. Well, let's say we start coming up with summer vacation plans. Anyone have any ideas? Beach trip! Oh, right. We should figure that stuff out. Cruise! You're fine to stay here through all of vacation, right? Amusement my men's parks. Well, how about a trip, guys? Come on, we've got a whole month to rage. A whole month. I'm sorry. Oh, man. And here we have three months. Um, aren't you forgetting about your homework? Blah. <laughs> uh, no, it's, it's vacation time. Why homework? Not only do you have homework, but your third years now. You need to start thinking not just about graduation, but post-graduation. Yeah, no, stop. Don't bring that up. Not now. <laughs> <laughs> Ryuji never changes. Back to the topic at hand. If I may suggest Kyoto. I'll find an abundance of inspiration if we tour each temple in Shrine. Um, you mentioned Kyoto once before, but it's just so you can go to a bunch of shrines and temples? Oh, the sheer wealth and beauty I can witness in a whole month. I can hear the treasures of our history calling to me. Yep, that sounds boring. JG Gerard, thank you so much, dude. If they could add another Persona 5 character to Smash Bros, who could it be? Um, I don't know. I would guess that they would probably just end up adding a catchy the villain uh, Persona 5 character. Yeah, if it's a month-long art tour, I'm totally gonna pass. The trip does sound nice, but what if we all went camping first? Ooh. We can all go hiking and stuff during the day and even throw together a barbecue at night. B -b barbecue Aren't those always the big gatherings for people who socialize IRL? Well, it's just gonna be us. It's gonna be fine, Futaba. <laughs> Sounds fun. You can leave the firewood chopping to me. Of course, because we all know that you are a beast with the axe. Kicking summer off right with a barbecue buffet. Sounds badass to Everyone's me. just setting up the tent. Just you? Haru in a nice summer dress just hacking away at wood. Just clean cleaving every single one. Wouldn't doubt that you'll cut down a whole damn tree and just drag it back to camp. Let's go all out on it. Look for decent marbling in the cuts. That's how you get the real good stuff. Trust me on this. It does sound rather fitting for the summer. I like the idea. We'll need an awful lot of vegetables to balance it out. Oh boy, an awful lot of vegetables for our, for our barbecue. Great. Uh, well, Haru, I guess you can bring the vegetables. Huh. A barbecue is one of the few things in this world that can pull me away from art. Our history's <laughs> treasures can wait a bit longer. <laughs> food? You have food? You're going to give me food? <laughs> Hashtag VUSK. Some things just never change. Choosing food over art. You sure your priorities are solid there, Inari? I'm pretty sure his priorities are pretty damn straight. Do you not see how thin he looks? He actually looks thinner than usual. All right. Our first reunion party has been unanimously decided. We're going camping. Woo! And with that settled... Emma, list recommended camping gear. Linden, thank you so much, dude. Hey, Akagano, good to see you again. Glad I caught you at the right time. You make me smile. I had to hurry my gra- Oh, I'm very sorry to hear that, too. I understand how you feel, man. Ed McGee, Haru, you're chopping wood. How is blood on you? <laughs> I have compiled a list of items recommended for camping. Oh, we got this game's version of Alexa now. There was a sporting and travel goods store near 705 in Shibuya. Customer reviews rate this as the best relevant store in your area. Ooh, what's that? The virtual assistant, Emma. You haven't heard of it yet? Oh, I think I have. It knows, like, basically everything and does all sorts of stuff for you, right? Oh, yeah. It's got this, uh, eye that thinks for it, right? 
I think you mean AI, not an I. <laughs> oh my god. Ryuji, come on. I didn't think you were that dumb. Correct. It stands for artificial intelligence. It can search all kinds of databases, conduct navigation, manage your schedule, even talk out logic problems and stuff with you. They could do all your homework. The makers go on about how you can ask it anything and you'll get the best possible answer. I remember seeing a demo of one on TV the other day. They were showing off its functions and talking about how it's the next big thing. Yep, that's it, all right. Pretty solid tech, considering it's roughly a thousand times smarter than Ryuji. Shut up! You sound kind of cool, though. <gasps> I bet you can tell us where all the best ramen shops are. Well, uh, Ryuji is interested only for that. <sighs> yeah, you should all download it. I'm telling you, it's the bee's knees. Something tells me that this app is going to play a major part in this entire story. I suppose it'd at least be handy if we ran into any trouble while camping. Evil virtual assistants. It's a good idea. Why don't you get it too? Yep, <laughs> we're all getting it on our phones. Hmm, interesting. Hello, this is Emma. I am pleased to meet you. I saw that logo on there. This is made by that group. Please provide me your name. Oh, um, ah! Now I can put my name in. Oh, I'm already up here. Kagany. Yeah. Ta-da! Oh, um, we have our options again. Let's see. Change battle music. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh. I'm liking that one. That sounds pretty cool, too. I'm liking this. Huh? Not bad. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, this one I don't have much experience with yet, but yeah, well. Yep, we can have it on random. Linden! Thank you so much, dude. Another thing to note, fighting Haru's old man in my core game, uh, in my core playthrough and hoping to get in this game after uh, for some time. Wish me luck, boss. Good luck, dude! So, oh, oh, you can actually have it on random, but you can turn specific songs you don't want on and off. Well, no, screw that, I'm gonna have them all on. Yeah! <laughs> Proceed without changing difficulty settings. Easy, breeze through battles, normal balance difficulty, hard for action game veterans. This can be changed later. Difficulty settings do not affect story content. Thank we'll keep you. it on normal for now, see how we uh, how well we do. Well, I feel like that we're just blasting through everything, then I'll change it to hard. If I feel like I get my ass kicked, I'll knock it down a peg. Gerard, thanks so much, dude. Do different music every time you go into different fight zones. Well Again, I am Emma. Your helpful virtual assistant. I, I don't want to exhaust one song too much, especially when I can just have it be random. You know? I, I think I'm going to keep it on just random. Looks like you've got it figured out. I sent you all friend requests. Please don't blow them up. Of course not. Displaying recommended camping items. So Emma came up with all that? Impressive, no? And it's not just random junk for sale either. It takes into account the season, the weather, your personal profile, and even your location for all its recommendations. That sounds a little too smart. <laughs> that sounds a little too smart. Come on. For real? Damn, that thing's eye is crazy. First off, take a shot. Second of all, it doesn't have an eye, it's AI! Ugh, AI, not an eye. Thank you, On. Well, should we split up and buy everything Emma's listed for us? Shopping trip! Oh, can't we do it tomorrow? It's so hot out. 
Oh, I bet this guy's beat from the traveling too. Yes, I'm so tired from sitting on a bus or a train rather. We just went through all the effort to meet up in the hideout, yeah? So let's make the most of it. Indeed. I have an absolute plethora of discussion topics for us to mull over. Let me guess. Art? Particularly matters such as modern art and the possibilities within it in our current age. Fuck it, let's go shopping. Yeah. Anything but that. Why do you look so surprised, Yusuke? We had a great time catching up together. Thank you for treating us all to curry, boss. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Just think of it as sort of a welcome back gift. Of course. With this guy hanging around again, he'll be nice feeling like old times. Same here. <laughs> Thanks again. We'll be back soon. Yeah, it's gonna feel like old times, but we're going on a road trip, so it's not like I'm really gonna be here that much. Sorry, boss. Well, see you tomorrow. You know, it was nice talking after so long. You make it seem like we haven't... Then again, they did mention at the beginning that Ryuji has a problem responding to texts. Has nobody been talking to me while I've been back home? Okay, let's get to shopping first thing tomorrow. Yeah, we gotta get everything Emma listed up for us, right? Then we should meet up by the Buchiko statue in Shibuya. See you then. Don't go forgetting, okay? How could I forget? It's literally tomorrow. And don't go forgetting about helping out behind the counter either. Oh shit, I forgot about that already and that was today. Oops. Bun wants Makoto's vest. Mm, she has a good taste, she has that good taste. Yeah, 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 I could totally see it. You, Bun, we are going to have to get together and talk about finding a good half leather vest for you. We got you a full leather jacket, let's get you a half jacket. Because that looks awesome. Now, that one she's wearing is short sleeve, so I guess it kind of comes down to you if you want short sleeve or long sleeve. I was a bit rusty at first, but I helped out around the cafe before returning to my room. Rusty? He gave you the recipes! Mm. Have you not been studying? I'm exhausted from all the excitement today. Let's get it. No! It's happening again! No, it's happening again! Don't tell me when to sleep, Morgana. I'm a grown ass man. I can sleep when I want. Saving. You can save your current progress when save is displayed at the lower right corner of the screen. Okie dokie. I should write something. Alright, how many slots do I have for this one? Nine only. Okay. Well, start on this one. And work our way in a rotation. Short sleeve? Alright. So you get the big jacket for your the long sleeve cold days and then the short sleeve for the for the hotter days. Or you can look as hot as the day is. You! You! Cat! I go to bed whenever the fuck I feel like. But considering there's nothing else I can do right here, not even a game system and all my shit that I gather all are gone, I don't even have my laptop anymore, I guess fine, fine, I guess I will go bed. So, I remember, wait, did you ever trade with that thing? I don't think you trade with that thing once. Yeah, I never trained with that thing once. <laughs> oh, God. Kenshin guard. <laughs> Kenshin says I got Metroid primed. <laughs> I lost everything. I tripped off the train and everything fell down a storm drain. Oh no. Oh, boy. Does this bed bring back memories? Oh, boy. Hashtag who boy. It's nice to see everyone doing so well. I'm so glad I added that <laughs> icon on my Discord channel. Just, just who boy. Everybody loves the who boy. Chiefs seem to be the same as ever, too. This place is just as great as I remember. Oh, God, you're right. The plant is still alive. Holy shit. <laughs> the lights made. Thanks so much, dude. Just bought Deluxe. Thanks for the wreck. <laughs> so, we're camping in a couple days, huh? 
talk about a way to kick off your summer vacation. Oh yeah, fun to shine, babes and bikinis. Let's go. I'm looking forward to it. Let's visit tons of places. Tons. <laughs> tons. That sounds great. All the places except for Kyoto. Fuck that. Well, we should get some sleep. <sighs> Good night. Actually, you know what? No, let's. We can go to Kyoto for a little while and let. Yusuke have his bit of fun. I mean, this is for everybody, and Yusuke wants to have some fun, too. And he's a good guy, and he needs food. Badly. I must be beat from all the traveling. I can tell that I'm drifting to sleep right away. Ah! <laughs> velvet Room! Wait, did it disappear? I thought the Velvet Room disappeared. Right, <sighs> maybe? I guess even he's surprised, like, I thought this all disappeared! Why am I still dressed like this? I thought I... I thought I passed the test! I was a bit rehabilitated. Hey, then, TG, I'm welcome to boss! Lavenza! And Igor? Why is Igor gone? Where is he now? Welcome. The Velvet Room. Lavenza, you don't look very happy to see me. Why am I in jail again? <sighs> okay, look, Lavenza. One, why are you here? Two, why is Igor not here? Three, why am I still in prison? Four, why is this room even here? Five, what do I need to save now? I know not whether to rejoice or bemoan this reunion. Regardless, I must perform my duty. <sighs> this place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. Lavenza, I know this. I was told this before. Please just get to the point. It is a room that only those who are bound by a contract may enter. Are you just requested to go through this sound and dance every single time that you need to have some teenage boy save the world? The expression you bear now tells me you already know the reason for your summons. I don't know shit! I must warn you of the danger threatening to consume both yourself and the entire world whose heart you strove so greatly to change. Bitch, I have been gone for just six months and already things are going to hell. Why is everyone such a dick still? I thought I already saved the world. Why is everyone still a dick? A most loathsome prison has manifested. Your appearance is ironclad evidence of this. Yeah, no kidding. I can tell. The prison is here. I'm behind the fucking chains and bars. You have become a prisoner of fate yet again. Whoopity do. Can't say I recall that. That is understandable. This is something only felt in the depths of one's heart. Ugh. Someone, even now, Plots to lure you into a disastrous fate. Lavenza, look, you sound like you're on the verge of tears. Can you just, you know, get to the point, please? Confronted by this evil will, your own cries out. Rise against it. I'll rise against whatever. Just let me get finished with my summer vacation first. My name is Lavenza. I know this already! As one who rules over power, my duty is to witness the path you take. Should the world continue down its own current path, all that awaits you is destruction. In other words, I didn't do a good enough job saving the world last time. Oh, fine. Give me back all my personas that I've earned up until this point. I can use Odin. I've got a giant dick I can use to slap God with. Have you the resolve to defy such a fate and face the distortion that yet again threatens your world. I mean, have you seen the damn thing? It's so huge, I have to use a, car a chariot to carry it around. <laughs> Fine, I'll do it! That is the trickster I know so well. Yay! What awaits you ahead are more of the same. No. Even greater hardships than before. 
However... Yes? You must never forget. I am always by your side. Well, that's more than what can be said about Igor! The time has come. Let us meet again soon. Until then, pleasant dreams. Gee, thanks for letting me sleep. But seriously, why have you not said anything about Igor? What have you done to him? Did you eat him? Well. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning! Hey, were you, have, were you having trouble sleeping last night, Kagato? You were tossing and turning like crazy. This is why I tell you you need to go to sleep even earlier every night, but you never listen to me, do you? And from now on, you go to bed as soon as you wake up. You go to bed right now! Alpha Dragon, thank you so much, dude! Is my imagination, or does Lavenza sound different from the original Game of the Royal? I don't know. Maybe? I, I guess and she sounds the same, but at the same time, she sounds a little different. Almost like she was constantly holding back tears. Anyway, it's time for us to meet up with Ryuji and buy our share of the camping equipment. Let's head over to the Buchiko statue. Whoopity doo! Anything out here? Oh god, they made the examination button circle? Oh crap. It's going to be another sunny day for Japan. The temperature's way up there, too. It will be especially hot in the central city areas, so take caution and watch out for signs of heat stroke. Hmm. Looks like it's going to be another hot out today. We better hurry and go before Ryuji melts. Yeah, he does complain about the heat a little too much, doesn't he? Yo. The city, hearts, the city heat's pretty bad. Don't forget to drink plenty of water and coffee. Lots of coffee. Drink my coffee. Drink my coffee. Wait, come back. You didn't get your coffee. Let's go. Uh, hey! <laughs> you know, Futaba... Let's go. Somehow, 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 yeah. Futaba took yellow shirt, blue... Uh, blue shoes, green trench coat, green like military green, and black and blue hat. No, wait, just black hat and blue headphones. Still makes it look pretty good. Although I gotta say, who Futami? Those uh, those shorts, th those are some. Uh, I think Odd would be jealous of how short those shorts are. I knew I'd be more help doing it all online, so I'm researching campsites now. I'll make sure to pick the best one. Playing in the river and eating barbecue all day, lighting fireworks and telling scary stories at night. Yeah! Horror stories! <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun. I can't wait another second. I'm so excited I'm gonna explode. Oh my god. And then Futaba comes right back. Here last night, I was talking about how Haru and Futaba, or, uh, Haru and Bun are very much alike. And then Futaba comes right back out and basically says, Bitch, you know I was here first. <laughs> yep, yep. I would say Bun is like 75% Futaba, 25% Haru. Alrighty. To Shibuya. Kenny C mentioned Parasite Eve. How do I know I need to get back to that? I know. <sighs> Whoa, Shibuya's as busy as ever. Look at all the people. Let's get the, the Bajiko statue right away. We don't want to leave Ryuji alone with his attention span for too long. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, wait, this is the statue? This is a statue. This is meant to be a statue? That's not a statue, that's a tree. He said, meet at a statue. Oh, this is the Buchiko, never mind. Never mind, that's the Buchiko statue. But still, what the hell is this? Why is this thing here? I thought this was like a, whatever, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it.
What's up? Ready to buy some camping shit? <laughs> yes, Ryuji, I'm ready to buy some camping shit. Uh, let's hustle to the store so we can finally chill for a bit. It's already way too hot out. Oh my god, Ryuji, stop complaining about the goddamn heat. You do not know what heat is until you live in southern Georgia. We're in charge of picking up the barbecue, right? Ooh. Go ahead and lead the way, Ryuji. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know where it is. Oh, right, we can just ask the app. Hey, uh, Emma? Hello, do you need something? Yeah, uh, show us that story you told us about. Displaying the optimal route to your destination. How did Emma know what he was talking about? Whoa, look at this sweet map. It knows too much. We can even figure out how to help with a big question like that? Oh, this thing's a whole lot more useful than I thought. I know, right? We're gonna. It's like it's a little too smart. Something's a little odd here. Great! Let's get this over with so we can plan tomorrow's feast. Uh, What's all the racket? I don't know, but my name's not Alice and I'm over here, yet some people over here are yelling to somebody else and, 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 and pay attention to me, damn it! I have a suggested event for you. Uh, yes, Emma? A promotional store opening is currently underway at the Shibuya 705 storefront with Alice Aragi. Uh-huh. Huh? The hell's a suggested event? For real? Alice is here? First of all, take a shot. Second of all, who the hell is Alice? And Alice is... Alice Hiraki is a Japanese fashion model and performing artist. Oh, basically an idol. Got it. She has gained attention with her adorable look and unique sense of style. She is active in a variety of media and genres. She has become a pop culture tastemaker and continues to amass a devoted young fan base. Yeah, she'll be forgotten in six months. Wow, Emma makes her sound huge. Is she really all that popular? Oh, I don't know. What kind of answer is that crowd giving you? Huh? Alice really is just over there. <laughs> oh, I can't believe it. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Oh, God, I'm actually falling over. Uh, okay, um, it's times like these that I wish I had a webcam up because let me explain. Hi, my name is Kagato. You're probably wondering how I got myself in this situation. I am currently on the edge of the bed about to fall over if I was done by the But I'm still part of it and I can't put myself to the other side. So I gotta basically fall on my face. Here I go! Ah, God! Ow. Okay. I think my face hit my belt. Ow. All right. All right. All right. Ah. I'm standing on my headphone cord. Ah, oh, good. Uh, I'm all right. I'm good. I'm good out. <laughs> Chase Williams, hey there, coming up my first time in your live stream. Thanks for what you do. You are quite welcome. Ah! The don't know really I literally covered your voice. <laughs> you couldn't hear half that explanation. Of the okay. So basically, I was so far over on the edge of the bed that I was actually falling over and but holding myself up from the floor with my right arm. So far that if I had tried to lift up my arm, I'd fall on my face. But I couldn't push myself back onto the bed. So it's just like, well... I guess there's one choice. I removed my arm and just landed on my face. 
Thanks, sicko! <laughs> 13 ace, are you okay? More or less! <laughs> Let's move on, shall we? Could not care less! Dude, you haven't changed at all, have you? I don't know who the idol is, so therefore I don't care. into the store, why not check it out? She's totally cute enough for this to be worth it! Uh, Ryuji, I'm currently dating somebody in this universe. I'm currently dating somebody in real life! I don't care how cute she is, I'm dating! Hey, hey, what's going on? Heard it's some shop opening ceremony. Wait, isn't that... Alice! Alice Hiraki! Oh my god. Hi, folks! Thanks for coming! You look like you tripped and fall, fallen into a sherbet. J just all the sherbet. A shop at Harry's, one of my very own brands, is opening here today. Have you ever dreamed that you could be somebody else, even if just for a little while? I don't dream it. I've lived it. Tell them, Ryuji. Tell everybody how we're Phantom Thieves. Um, is there booze? I'll go if there's booze. Aw, oh, thanks. Then I have a surprise for you. Okay. Kenshin, thanks so much, dude. No kind of your relationships were lost because of Castle Oblivion. Oh, no. I'm giving away 100 invitation cards as a special present. They're magical cards. That will make you have an even better time in Wonderland. Enjoy! If you believe in magic! <laughs> Here you go! Oh, oh my god, thank you so much! <laughs> <laughs> oh, and one for you! Well. Alice just touched my hand. Oh, I was going to say, how rude. Not even say thank you, but no, you're freaking out about that. Okay. Oh, those are some quality specs. Why, thank you. They're fake. <laughs> Sorry, that was weird. I hope you like the star. Well, I'll be nice. Thank you very much. I'll check it out. Alice handed me a card. Well, she was all out. Didn't give one to Ryuji. Here you go, Ryuji. Apparently, you wanted it more. Yay! Yeah. Oh, the sherbet! Rainbows and cotton candy! Jeez, what was with that crowd? I have no earthly idea, but apparently she's important. Man, I can't believe I saw Alice. She was just as cute as I thought she'd be. All right, calm down there, Yosuke. Her outfit's weird. <laughs> you just don't get it. Her being different is what makes her so awesome. Oh my god, is she supposed to be Lady Gaga then? Well, she's all yours. My heart still belongs to Lady Anne alone. You're welcome to have her. I got myself somebody already in this universe and the next. Yeah, yeah, we get it. Shut up, Ryuji! I can flaunt my girlfriend as much as I want! Well, are you satisfied now? Let's hurry up with the shopping. I'm talking about Bun, not Haru, but... in Joker can flaunt Haru. And Futaba. Fuck it, he's doing both. Two different universes. Fine, fine. Oh, yeah, you got one of those cards from Alice, right? Yeah, here you go. <laughs> yeah, he did. You just got blown up. <laughs> Can it? There were just a ton of people around us all. You were literally right next to me and she was going in a row. She probably gave me her last one. 
Ultis, thanks so much, dude. And Spider Sense Tingling, Kagano, punch her butt. Um, is that appropriate? Card says Alice Hiragi's Wonderland. Alice Hiragi's Wonderland? It just looks like a boring old ad to me. Yeah, it kind of is, isn't it? Although I got an ace of spades. Hmm? There's some fine print here. Oh, so fine print. Here's my Emma keyword. Please become my friend. Oh, really? What's a keyword? Didn't Futaba use something like that yesterday? She said we could become friends through Emma. Yeah, do it. Come on. Nightzilla asks, I forgot who Persona 3 Kagano went with. Technically, he went with everyone because he couldn't complete a social link without dating somebody, so he got with everyone. He went full harem. <laughs> I guess I can add Alice as a friend. So you input the keyword, then you become friends with Alice? I guess. You said it's on the card, right? What was it again? Uh, Wonderland? Keyword successfully entered. Beginning navigation. Wait, navigation? What? Um. Hello. Is Emma the new meta nav? Well, shit. I don't know. Feels like. Whoa! What happened to you guys? Not just me. You changed too. Whoa! For real? Take a shot. <sighs> Looks like this place is connected to the metaverse. This is a joke, right? Oh. oh. Whoa, check it Look. out. Huh? Aren't those the guys we saw at 705? Really? Hey everyone! You love me, don't you? Uh -huh. Yeah. Alpha Dragon, thanks so much. Oh yeah? Then you can give me all your desires. Uh, what? <laughs> you think Strike will be an animation show? I doubt it. Wait a fucking minute! They're dragging people into... There's no time. We'll figure it out later. Joker, Skull, let's fight our way out. Oh, ho, ho, I like the sound of this song already. Meet the lust-themed enemy at this time. Thanks, Gerard. Stay sharp, you two. We'll be back in some time. Just warm up a bit for starters. It'll come back to you soon enough. Oh, hell yeah! <laughs> 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 we should get in Oh my god, this is so fun! Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you! <laughs> Stop ending it when I'm having fun! Joker, use your persona! Alright! X while holding R1 for some skills. Hold R1. Yeah, I saw that before. Persona! You're mine. Zero on down enemies, all out attacks. So if an enemy is knocked down, press zero to initiate all out attack with your teammates! So if they can deal damage at several enemies at once, it's a good idea to use all attack on large groups of enemies. When the enemy's down gauge is completely defeated, when we knock down, the enemy's down gauge by striking us, we just come out on a critical attack. Oh my god! <laughs> Oh my god! This is so awesome! 
on-screen prompt phantom dash press circle to move swiftly after a phantom dash you will automatically go into hiding yes kind of embrace the bloodlust thanks akachi sure triangle while in hiding special axes depending on the situation sure pressing triangle while in hiding different actions such as attack or moving moving while in hiding switch targets if you are in hiding and there are no more points to phantom dash to okay All right, circle and prompted and triangle. Got it. Oh, nice! Oh my God! Where's the rest of them? Oh. Well, I'll get you guys. Oh, I did it. It's over. Alright, you know what? I played a couple of warrior type games and I did not really have the best time. I'm liking this. I'm liking this. <laughs> what else? No, you can't escape from me. Go for it, Gerard, hashtag Kagano Pasa. Watch out! Uh oh. Oh, yeah. Fuck that shit, I'm wrecking him! Uh uh, no, I'm beating them up. Do I have to? Let's move it. Oh, I have to. They're not taking any damage. Okay. They're not taking any damage. Oh my god. Oh, that's so good! That was so good! Okay. What in the hell is this place? A fucking playground is what it is! Metaverse? Oh! Uh -huh. I think this could be Alice's palace. So, oh yeah! Back on that note. So, now in this game, they're dragging people into the metaverse, if this is the metaverse, and actually taking something from them. So, yeah, that's kind of dangerous. Palace? I thought those were done for, though. I mean, we don't even have the meta nav on our phones anymore. I know, it's almost like Emma is kind of replacing it, isn't it? I don't know what's going on, but I don't think anything else could explain this. You saw Alice on that screen just like I did. No matter how you look at it, that was her shadow. We just happened to wander into Alice's palace using Emma. That would be the most logical explanation. Damn it! Whatever it is doesn't change the fact that we're in deep shit. Mm, we need more intel. Let's investigate the area. <laughs> this really is a palace? The distortion has to have a core somewhere. We need to find the treasure. This is the thrill I needed. This is the thrill I totally needed. Oh, even getting a faint whiff of it. If we look around, we may be able to learn what's going on too. We'll get a better idea of what to do next, depending on what we find. Guess we're doing this. We are fucking doing this. Guys, this ain't gonna be a Persona 5 situation. 
I'm gonna make sure that this game is constantly updated because I don't think we're gonna stop playing this. Oh my god! Oh my god! Well, at least I'm not gonna stop playing it until I'm done. With it. Like, it reaches reach the end of the game. You know what I mean? But, oh my god! So awesome! And the hype music honestly has a lot to do with it. Oh shit. Ah, oh, we can take him. <laughs> Shit! Never mind. This ain't fair. <clears throat> um. <sighs> Ow! I got clobbered. Really? Really? We got taken hostage. <laughs> Don't push me. I've been moving. Hi, Alice. Is this your wonderland? Who are these little guys? Why are the carousel horses wearing fetish gear? Your Majesty, we captured these thieves, but we couldn't seize their desires. We have instead brought them to you. <laughs> couldn't? Desires? Explain yourselves. Oh, well, that makes hmm. sense. You look pretty cool. So, what's your name? Captain Butt Puncher! Ow! The Joker! I did not consent for Senpai to step on me. Only Bun is allowed to do that. Joker, huh? Come now, Joker. You need to answer properly when your queen asks a question. Quit it, asshole! Ugh, would you shut your mouth? Or are you looking for punishment, too? You really have no idea what you're up against, do you? We literally beat God! What on earth are you going to do here? What? Shit! Just try it! I'm pretty sure Ryuji by himself can take you. What a bore. I just stopped caring. Get rid of them, however. I don't want toys that don't do as they're told. Bye-bye. Sure. All right. Save it. Oh, lock on. Ryuji would like her to step on him. <laughs> they just literally. They... Uh, 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 hey, you guys okay? So she just hurled us out the door and said, "Go away." I. She really is just looking for people to simp on her, <laughs> or people to take their desires from. I don't know. Yeah, luckily. He's like, well, I can't take your desires. You won't sip for me. Well, fine. Leave. <laughs> Go. <laughs> Man, that was some real shit. Even worse was that effing... So that's what she's really like, huh? So, Ryuji, that whole thing about I don't care, do you believe it now? Gerard, thank you so much, dude. Damn, after six months, you lose all the experience you got. That's gotta suck. Yeah, I know. How about you, Joker? She really whacked you. Uh, it was nothing. I'll get back at her. <laughs> you said it. Damn that Alice. Acting like she's top shit. I really wish that Joker was given a third option that said I kind of liked it. <laughs> I, they should have done that. They should have given Joker that option to say I kind of liked it. <laughs> I'm going to be so pissed off until we finally get back at her. So, where are we now? John Manahan, thank you so much, dude. Ryuji not telling her you're the fan of these ruins immersion. Hey, <laughs> did you know where them? <laughs> Looks like we wound up underground. I'd say it's some sort of garbage dump. Oh, she literally tossed us into the trash. Well, now I'm even more upset. For now, 
Let's just focus on getting out of here. All right. This place is disgusting. Who just dumps people into garbage like that? Apparently she does. Let's find a way out as soon as possible. Oh man, I can't wait to find out how everyone plays in this. Oh. What we'll run into either. Let's keep an eye on how we're holding up as we press on. Oh my god, I can't wait to play as Haru! <laughs> Giant axe and grenade launcher! Oh, let's go! Command menu. This menu allows you to check the status of party members and adjust equipment, among other things. Fire! Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. Hm. There we go! I like the style. Well, it's, this game is just oozing style everywhere, but I mean... I like the style. I like it. Just be like it. Oh? <laughs> Wait. Okay. All right. They're opening a chest. I just see Haru over there, crouched over, and we're kind of holding some keys. And I'm thinking, what are you two doing? <laughs> Yo. Hey, we have no equipment. We suck. <clears throat> uh, we have no personas. We suck. <laughs> Well, at least I'm up there with on. My stats okay. How about you? System. Hi. Wait, there isn't a single one with Makoto. <laughs> Item. <laughs> one, two. Either there was there either there's a menu that's missing that's gotta be unlocked later, or Makoto got the shaft here. Makoto's not in any single one of those. So I gotta assume that there's another menu that's gonna unlock at some point. Yes. Are you are you a box of importance? This looks like some sort of container. Oh, oh it's a box. Companion cube? Oh, I just have the magic touch. But does the magic touch equal good or bad? We're moving Sophia, starting to do the bit 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 bit. Thanks for Rob me, Ragnarok. Unlock later. Got it. What would you like to become? Uh. Uh. My companion cube has turned into a girl. I like my new power. What is this place? It's the garbage! Who are you? Um, I'm not a phantom thief. Ignore what the blonde-headed dumbass behind me says. <laughs> Who are you? I am Sophia, humanity's companion. She is a companion cube! Nice to meet you. What are you doing? You've been... Uh... What? Correct. That means I make for a good companion to people. Holy shit, she's a companion cube. Are you human? Do you have a name? Um, yes, I am Human. I have Human name. Joker. Ho human. Okay, I memorized yeah, it. Yeah, Human name of Joker, yes. Joker? Do you know where this place is? It's hey, the, I just heard something! It's the train! That's right, I summoned girl. Hey, Ryuji, I found a girl here! Very, 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 very short dress. But she is wearing shorts. Uh, I mean, who are you? She's the companion cube I summoned. What is it, Joker? Uh, uh can I help you? <laughs> A raccoon? <laughs> what? Try a cat. I thought you wanted to be human, Morgana. Wait, don't try a cat. I know, right? <laughs> Make up your mind. 
Anyway, who's this? Got a real funky getup. I'm not. I'm not gonna bash the getup. I mean, look at us. We look kind of ridiculous too. She popped out of a box. Pretty cute, huh? Humanity's companion. Um, uh, she popped out of a box. What? <laughs> okay, Ryuji. I'm going to say this very slow. I place hand on box. She pop out of box, and now she companion. I am Sophia, humanity's companion. What she said. Were you dumped down here by that Alice girl too? Hmm. I just learned that I have no memories, so I do not know. Well, let's go on a great adventure to get your memories back or plant new memories into you. Wait, what? Ryuji, just let me do the talking. You're obviously lost here. Hey, you two. Come here for a second. All right. Who she's, is that Joker? She's just staring at the garbage. <laughs> I told you, I pressed my hand up against a box and she popped out of it. She said she doesn't have any memories? She came out of a giant box? I know, it's weird, right? Since when did I have that kind of power? Why didn't you tell me that if I touched boxes, women would pop out of them? What shit is that? Way too weird. I'd have a whole harem by now! She doesn't seem to be a shadow, though. She doesn't even seem hostile. Well, whatever she is, we still gotta find a way out. Nobody's solving any problems in this dump, that's for sure. In trouble? Uh, yes. Whoa, where did you- If you're in trouble, I can help. <laughs> oh my god, Gerard says, oh god, she's waifu Baymax. <laughs> I am humanity's companion. My purpose is to be helpful to humans. Um, I would, okay, Sophia, I'm going to tell you this right now. You want to be helpful to humans, but there are certain humans that you should not be helpful towards. Especially humans that have a very interesting interest in you, if you know what I mean. Do not be helpful to them. So... You want to help us out? What is your problem? Well, uh, we're lost. I guess we're looking for a way out of here? A way? Will reaching the surface solve your problem of a way out of here? Why do I have a feeling that the Emma application is tied to Sophia in some way? Like Sophia was the beta version of it and then Emma came after? Uh, yeah. It would? Okay, I've got it. I'm searching for a way out of here. Yep, uh, don't tell me I called it. Don't tell me I called it. Well, hey, don't go out there alone. What now, Joker? You follow her. Right. She might be able to get us out of this dump. You sure about that? Still super suspicious. Don't be suspicious of literally everybody that you meet, Ryuji. If anything, you're the most suspicious person among us. But I guess we shouldn't ditch her either. And that's with a talking humanoid cat next to me. Hey, hey, you better watch out for shadows. Oh crap, too late. Get behind us, Sophia. Don't make friends with it. It's got a rod. And it'll use it on you. And it'll hurt. Where the hell did they come from? Nobody's coming for us if we go get here. This is it. Take this. Uh, I hit nothing. Good job. Woo. We got through that somehow. Sophia, right? You heard her anything? No problems here. Why was I attacked? Assaulting others without reason is not proper behavior. <laughs> uh, because shadows are mean, nasty poo-poo heads, that's why. Uh, not exactly sure how to explain it, but those guys are called shadows. And we are the Phantom Thieves. We're considered dangerous rebels by the ruler of this place. Intruders they want to eliminate. The Phantom Thieves? You know... We can't really make our identity secret if we keep going around telling everybody who we are. That's Just saying. really cool. That's what you have to say? Compliment, I guess. 
Anyway, there is a shit ton of shadows around here. If you want to help us, then let's all go together. I can find a way out of here. You only need to wait for me. You're actually going to help us out? Yay! I have been helping you this entire time. This is true. Companion Cube is there for helping. Joker helped me first. Now I will be helpful for him. Use me as needed, Joker. Freezing! <laughs> All right, you're weird, but I guess you really do want to help. Freezing! It's your goal, Joker. Ah. Uh, I hope we get along! Okay, that sounds nice, Joker. Along with the hat and the skeleton. <laughs> what? I'm not a skeleton. No, that'd be Yusuke. Da 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 da. <laughs> Skull short for Skullington now. Oh my God. <laughs> this is Halloween. This is Halloween. No, wait, just because I look like this doesn't make me a cat. It totally makes you a cat, dude. He's actually a raccoon. Joker! <laughs> I'm Skull. Don't screw it up. And I'm Mona, okay? Don't you forget it. What's that, Raccoon and Skellington? What has upset you? <laughs> oh, right. Let's be careful. <laughs> this is just... Oh, this is just too far. We'd be fine, but we don't want to endanger Sophia. Try staying out of sight. All right. When you're stuck, the upper right corner of the screen displays your current objective, as well as a hint to help you complete that objective. All right, escape underground waterway. Head above ground. All right. Wait, a shadow. Uh-oh. hanging around. I'm pretty sure we can take it on. We can literally take on armies of these guys. We've got Sophia with us. We should just avoid it if we can. Oh yeah, that's right. The whole protect Sophia thing. Are you saying that's in your way? Yeah. We can't escape unless we get past here. Okay. I've got it. Huh? Got what? Oh my god. Is she gonna go kick its ass? Wait, what the hell? Triggered by using corresponding skills on enemies that are inflicted with the status ailments that can deal increased damage as well as keep the ground gauge. Yes. Oh. Uh oh. Oh, she just beat the fuck out of him. Okay. Slash. <laughs> oh, this is so fun. Okay, we beat them. <laughs> 
<laughs> Companion Cube is strong! <laughs> Alpha Dragon, thank you so much, dude. Yo, yo, Pop. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, yeah? You're so effing strong. You should have told us right away you could fight. But you never asked. Oh, she's got us there. Not just that, but your clothes. What in the world? Uh, her clothes haven't really changed that much. I mean, she's now wearing a hood. It's completely different from our own transformations. I copied what you do and ended up like this. Uh... Is she a Persona user? Yeah, this ain't just about the clothes. Uh, are you some kind of Persona user? Persona? Don't tell me you just copied that too. The things you were using during the fight. Those boxes flying around. That was a weapon. I needed it to fight. Hey, okay. Sophia, just what in the world are you? I am Sophia, humanity's companion. I think we get that much, but there's still other questions. Also, um, you know what? Never mind. Yeah, we already heard that one. There's still just too much we don't know. But we don't have the time to figure it out now either. Getting out of here needs to be our number one priority. Yeah, we really don't need her getting any more attention from the enemy. Hey, let's just have her help us out. Considering what we just saw, I don't think we'll have a problem. Agreed. We have no idea what's ahead of us. The more firepower, the better. Yeah! Can you lend us a hand, Sophia? Okay, I've got it. Why on earth was she thrown in the trash? She's awesome! I'm counting on you. Right. You'll be counting on me. She's adorable. I want one. Well, let's move. Lead the way, Shorty. <laughs> Is that her fan of the name? Understood. Oh, right. Keep track of how you're holding up. You need any healing items? Uh, let's see. Using items. Press options to open the grand menu. Continual items can be used in the items. So many this can also be done during battles. Everybody's in good shape, okay? Okay, I think we're clear. Let's move it. Yay. Check anything things suspicious looking. Never know what you might find. There we go, there's the dash again. Actually, you're right. Huh. Oh! Oh! There's a devil job. Huh? Picking up items while exploring the metaverse. You'll notice that items scattered around. These can be very from junk that we sold for money to valuable recovery items. Make sure to pick up items whenever you see them. That looks suspicious. Wasn't there one that was just floating there? There it is. We'll be taking this. Huh. Oh, excuse? <laughs> what the? Was that just an eye? That's an eye! <laughs> oh, that's a flag. Huh. I've located a treasure chest. Let's open it. Oh my god, her eyes. Well, Joker, what did you find? Uh, I have no idea. What did I find? Did it pop up on screen? If it did, I didn't see it. Oh well. Huh. Bob and air double jump. Yep, I got it. Huh. Yay, more fighting! Shadows incoming! A whole load of them. Get ready! There are more ways to target an enemy's weakness than skills alone, remember? Gun! R1 while holding... Uh... Oh. L1 holds the gun, R1 fires gun. While aiming the gun holding L1, you can fire R1. Each type of gun has its own ammo stock. After battle ends, ammo will replenish. Okay, so I can just use the gun whenever I feel like between battles. Take this! Now! <laughs> Take this! Woohoo! So 
I can't chase a tree by uh, Parker's yet. Take this. Bang. Up, just down. Now I'm even more dependable. Learning skills and passive skills. After battle, if you set level up, their stats will increase and they potentially learn new skills. Some skills activate automatically do not need to be activated by holding R1 and pressing X. Okay. Yeah. Awesome. Awesome, 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 awesome. Oh. Ah, mass destruction! Oh, <laughs> here we go! A new skill also use skills. When a skill name appears above an enemy, it means they're prepared to use that skill. Use situational awareness to avoid enemy attacks and go on the offensive. I'm already going ham! <laughs> Uh-oh, status ailments. Items recovery skills, some ailments can also have their effects shortened by rotating L. Shock! Part members inflicted with shock will have their movement speed reduced, so this can be cured with every inner drop. Enemies inflicted with shock will have their movement reduced. Physical and nuclear attacks will trigger a technical hit. Close range attacks from shocked enemies have a chance of spreading the ailment. Ooh. Oh, I'm inflicted with shock. All right, check it out. Get off of me! Teammates who are fighting alongside you may support you by using recovering your buff skills. Thank you. Oh, what do we have here? I'm loving this so much. Oh God, I love this. Hey, Joker, think you could find your way up there? Maybe. If I try hard enough and believe in myself and trust the hard cards and with the power of friendship. It's not a shadow in sight. Better keep moving. I'm pretty sure a shadow's coming up right now. Red. Shadow's ahead. They haven't spotted us The yet. red ones. Should I... Wipe them out for you? <laughs> yes, please. Here's a tip on us phantom thieves. We avoid charging headfirst into battle whenever possible. Uh, sure about that, but God, I'm pretty sure that's what I've been doing this whole time. Let's try those stairs for now. Oh, but I want to fight. Let's try those stairs for now. Oh, damn it, Morgana! I see. See that hanging there, Joker? You thinking what I'm thinking? <sighs> Attack using terrain. Oh. Oh. I see. I see. It seems us to use the environment to allow us to do a uh, surprise attack. That was quick. <laughs> Yay, we won. She's so adorable. Don't celebrate just yet. Aren't we in a dead end? Nope, yeah. I saw that before. If we climb there, we can proceed. I'm adopting her. There's no other option. But we have our daughter. But we have a first daughter. I'll catch you! Rip it, Joker! You're the battle, goddammit! Let me see. I've got eyes on them! No, you don't! We're hiding up here! Shit! Hey, don't quit! Let's take him down, Joker! Alright! Now. 
Oh my god, this is so fucking awesome! Yeah, I'm gonna use only one, I don't care. I'm having so much fun with this. Take this! <laughs> Sing it down! Take this! Bang! Oh, I missed. Did Morgana turn into a buzz saw? That's awesome! Uh-oh. Ooh, you got another persona. Hey! Looks like that power you've got is live and away. Gerard, thank you so much. Name your first daughter Sophia. I don't know. I guess that's what we're gonna have to talk about later on in life. The enemy became a mask? Explain this. <laughs> she looks so excited. <laughs> so starry eyes. Oh my god. He seals the shadow's form and power into a mask, turning it into a persona. Oh, interesting. Gaining personas. When the fitting shadows that have shown their true forms, a mask may appear by picking up the mask or by completing the battle. You will obtain a new persona. Yeah, I got Pixie now. Wait, so... I got Pixie. Stats. See you Dia. Let's use Pixie a little bit and see what happens. Hi. Enemy ahead. Hello. Oh, that a horse. Joker, try that persona you just got. Ah, already ahead of you. To right while holding R1 for soda change. Joker's infinite potential allows him to carry multiple personas. He can switch these at okay. Switching personas also switches the skills you can use and changes some special attacks that you can perform. Serve your enemy and choose the persona that is most suited to your to your current battle. Okay. Joker's currently equipped persona will also affect his stats and affinities. When you become comfortable with switching personas, keep a mental note of what persona to have equipped. Come! You're mine. <laughs> oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> oh. Zero during on screen prompt one more. Foes of larger down gauges won't be knocked down right away. Break a shield icon uh, to create an opening and press circle during that to attack again. Hayden TGM, thank you so much. I'm going to put the knife down. You're scarring me how feral you're going. <laughs> 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 Oh my god! Tutorials! Okay. Lock on. When you want to prioritize specific enemy to attack, R3 to lock on. Okay. Battles will go more smoothly if you focus on enemies with problematic skills or wide attack ranges first. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. You're my target. Everybody else get the grunts! Take this. Oh my god! This is an actual boss! Kind of... Ah. Oh, it's got a health bar. I just realized. All right, I gotta be a little bit more careful here. Uh oh, guys. Let's go. All right, I gotta also pay. Yeah. Oh, I missed the one more. I'm done. Knocked down party members. If party members are repeatedly hit too many times, they can result in a knockdown. You're more likely to get knocked down if your weakness is hit or you're currently struck by a critical technical hit. You cannot act while you are knocked down. You recover fast while rotating out. Okay. Persona! Oh, no. You knocked down my Sophie! I... Come hold on, hold on. Set. No. Pixie! Dia. There we go. I'll use this. There we go. I'm so grateful. Gotcha! Okay! 
Mastered Arts. Each character has their own unique set of skills known as Master Arts. By using that character, they will gradually learn these abilities. As a character learns Master Arts, their capabilities are better expand. Check a character. Okay. Marking Shot. Perform a follow up after a triangle or mid air triangle. Not attack. Okay. Oh, basically you sh like attack them, attack them, attack them, shoot them, and then dash at them. Yeah, okay. Oh my goodness! <laughs> so many tutorials! Circle during on screen, prop, follow up, attack, when you put the enemy and link into a chain of square attacks. Okay. After the midair square chain attack, just for some skill thing. Okay. Ow! Fire! Uh oh, oh! Oh, hold on! I got gotcha. you. Ow, gotcha! Gotcha! Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. Oh, what do I get? What do I get? Oh, I got jack o' lantern! Oh my god! Captain Kid, ha, huh? good to see you again, buddy. Lunge! How are you holding up? Make sure you heal yourself when you need it. Uh, I'm okay. Auto recover. Okay, yeah. Press it down to auto recover. Auto recover makes use of your party's healing skills to immediately restore HP to all party members. Be aware of that. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, uh, let's do it. Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo! No enemies nearby. Let's go on ahead. Oh, wait, no. There we go. Hang on. It looks like this is the exit. Oh, hell yes. Let's get our asses out of here. Yay! This where they're in there. Should we investigate? Nah. We should focus on our escape. So this one? No. There we go. We did it! Uh, we finally made it out. That was a big garbage dump. This is still the metaverse, though. Stay on guard. Please wait. What is it, Sophia? Find something? <sighs> I have found it. A way out of here is nearby. For real? Take a shot! Wait, how'd you figure that out? I suddenly knew it. Like, <laughs> oh my god, she's so cute! Seriously? Oh my god, she's like an Igis and Futaba fused. The exit is close. Follow me. Hey, wait, Sophia! What is her deal? Oh, I don't know, but we need to move it. Is this the way out you mentioned, Sophia? Yes, this is what I had detected previously. Oh! Uh, and it is? Um, a green butthole in the wall. It's fine. It leads outside. Leads outside? Everything will get all... <laughs> but then you'll be out of here. <gasps> oh my god, I love her! <gasps> ah! What the hell kind of explanation is that? How do you know we'll be okay? Trust me, Joker. Might as well try it. <laughs> I'm glad you're willing to trust me. I've got no reason not to at this point. Mm. Looks like we've only got one option here. Huh? Ain't you coming too? I am... What should I do? Uh... Let's all go back together. Joker's got the right idea, Sophia. This place is crawling with shadows. 
Staying here would only end badly for you. But... Jeez, what's it gonna take? What? What are you doing? Kidnapping! We don't leave folks behind to die. Just get in the damn portal with us. We must protect! So you want me to come with you? Uh, okay. Well, here goes. One, two... She must be protected at all costs! This is the real world, right? Let me guess, she's not there. Because she can't escape the other world, can she? Yep, looks like we're back, all right. You have successfully returned from the jail. Welcome back. <laughs> Thanks for not letting that sound too loud for everyone else to hear it. Jail? Hang on, Sophia. Where'd she go? I don't think I'm seeing her. Hey, Shorty, get your ass over here! Did you call me Shorty? Don't yell that in public, idiot! Look, Morgana, he already has a history of yelling things out in public that he shouldn't yell out, okay? We should probably expect this from him. Hey, everyone! I'm a Phantom Thief! Need something? Yay! Wait, she's there? Was that Sophia's voice? Huh, where is she? I'm in front of you, inside Joker's phone. Oh my god. My phone is acting weird. What's with the floating head? Yo. Oh my god, I got a Sophia app. Whoa, she just popped up. Oh, did you change your outfit? Is that really you, Sophia? Yep, I'm really me. But who are you? Uh, Ryuji, I swear to God, if you yell out more Phantom Thieves right here, right now, I'm going to slam your head against that window. I'm still Mona. I just look like a cat in this world. Mona? You're Mona? So you really weren't a raccoon. Oh my God! I already told you that. Wait. Why are you on his phone now? Why am I? Because I am an AI. An AI? I think my theory is starting to gain a little bit here. A, uh, uh, that's that smart thing, right? Yeah, the thing that's smarter than you? Futaba told us all about it. She's an artificial intelligence. She's a sweet, adorable cinnamon roll, and she needs to be protected at all costs. I don't care if she's an AI. She's physically there, and I want her. For real? Take a shot! Well, I'm glad you're safe. I have your phone to thank for that. Yeah! Oh! So she's able to be... Okay, so being on my phone... Me, I am never getting rid of this phone. Or I'm transferring her over somehow. I don't know. I was thrown into endless light. When I tracked down Joker's scent... I ended up here. Wait, my scent. Do I smell? A scent? Who are you, Morgana? So since she's an AI, she turned into data when she came to this world. But I don't smell, do I? Does that mean you're living in his phone? It is somewhat small, but it's cozy and has everything I need. Here to join me? Um, we can't exactly go inside the phone. Wait, it has everything. How? What? Questions. I have questions. How? I, I don't even know how to begin said questions. <laughs> I, I, I don't even have the answer. I, I, I can agree with you right there. Anyway, it's a big relief knowing you made it out of there safely. Phone daughter. Oh my god, she's my phone daughter. Hide my search history. Oh god. Well, no, I don't search for that kind of stuff on my phone. I do it safely behind the doors on my computer. Wait, did I? I shouldn't be talking about. Or change the subjects! Hey, but 
what, what about all those other people we saw in there? Are they still, you know... I think they're dead. I don't know. But I seriously doubt normal folks would be able to fight against that. Let's rescue them. I get what you're saying, but if we charge in without a plan, we're just going to wind up captured too. A new part of the metaverse has its own version of a palace that we access through Emma. It even has a ruler shadow. Odds are that something horrible is happening right now. Uh... I've got a bad feeling about this. Yeah, me too. Let's get to LeBlanc. We'll hammer out our course of action with everyone there. And what about her? It appears I cannot exit this phone. Well, we're taking it with us. When I came to this world, I connected to the internet and learned a great many things. Ooh, wait, 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 wait. No, no, Sophia, there was already a robot that did that and determined that all life needed to be extinct. We don't need that to happen again. I, we should probably show you the terrors of a movie called Avengers Age of Ultron. But my memory is still erased. I also found no means of data recovery. We also need to find a real world body for Sophia. Furthermore, I am stuck here. What should I Wait do minute. next? That's right! I guess androids exist in this world! It could totally be possible to transfer Sophia into a robot body. We will have our phone daughter yet! Come see where I'm crashing. So we're both crashing somewhere. Yay! Also, introducing Sophia to everyone else will probably make the explanation easier. Totally. They'll be confused, <laughs> but it'll work. I uh, wonder how that's gonna go over, especially when they hear all the palace type shit. There are more phantom thieves? Um, yeah, quite a big group. Yeah, we got ourselves a whole gang. One of them will probably flip her wig over you, too. Oh, that's gonna be Futaba, of course. Okay. That sounds pretty fun. Oh, my God. I see. So you didn't pick up the food. You're saying you entered the metaverse with Alice Hiragi's invitation and met a sentient AI named Sophia, who is now in your phone. <laughs> well, when you put it that way, it sounds kind of stupid. When you put it that way, you make it sound crazy. <laughs> Why do I do commentary? Ryuji had it already. But I'm telling you, it's the truth. Uh... We're just messing with you. <laughs> what? Dude, shut up! You want to believe in us or not? <laughs> and that's why we don't have any food for Yusuke. I'm sorry. We understand. None of us would make up something like this. I don't know. I fucking would just for laughs. <laughs> However, there's a chance this Sophia may know more than we do about this situation. Pull her. <clears throat> I'm going to rephrase that before I say it. Please present the phone to everyone. She's still with you, right? Could we speak with her? Fuck it. Let me pull Sophia out of my pants. Hold on. Yeah. Let's see if there's anything Sophia can add that could help us figure out what's happening. Could you come join us, Sophia? Yo, Phantom Thieves! <laughs> she was saying, yo, she's so cute! You're so cute! <sighs> Whoa, what is that? Utama's new best friend! I am Sophia, humanity's companion. That's really Sophia? I know, isn't she adorable? I adopted her. Wow, I can't believe this is happening. Is this some sort of hideout? There seem to be a number of phantom thieves present. <laughs> I'm sorry, but you are adopted. You're permanently adopted. She's humming to herself? I know, right? She's adorable! What in heaven? I know, right? She's adorable! Such an adorable design. I can feel the charm. 
pain, the tenacity within. Well, you scale like, sir. Wait, what? So, yeah, this is Sophia. Nice meeting you. Okay, an AI with genuine will is just way too advanced. Right? We couldn't believe it either. Care to introduce yourselves? Uh, that's right, we're meeting for the first time. Nice to meet you, Sophia. I'm Makoto Nijima. Oh my god, Makoto, your pants have laces on the thigh? Oh my god, okay, Makoto, look, you're a wet blanket, but holy shit, your style is amazing. My name's Haru Okumura. We're both college students, but I also help out with my family's company. I'm on Takamaki. I'm a third year in high school, and I do some modeling too. My name is Yusuke Kitagawa. I continuously strive to master the arts as we know them. And I'm perpetually hungry. <laughs> so, uh, I'm next, huh? That's right, Futaba. You get to introduce yourself to not only a new person, but an AI that's self-aware. I'm Futaba Sakura, and I kind of suck at socializing, but, but I want to be friends and stuff. Oh my god! Futaba's all so adorable! Can I? I want to adopt both. Ah, you did great, Futaba. In fact, I bet you and Sophia will get along real awesome. Yeah, I totally see that. Makoto, Haru, An, Yusuke, and Futaba. I'll remember that. You all have much more normal names than Joker. <laughs> Ooh, right. We skipped that part. Uh, so, we're the Phantom Thieves. But... Ryuji Shin! No, but actually, she, that's... Um, I guess it counts. Fine, Ryuji, you get this this one time. We call each other by code names in the metaverse, so our enemies won't discover our real identities. Code names. My name's actually Ryuji Sakamoto. The cat's Morgana, and he's... Kagato Jirai, okay. the final boss. I'll remember that. Um, so you really are a computer program? Derby Gamer asks Boss, how many are we keeping? And I answer with, as many as necessary. Correct. Would you like to see my source code? Nah, that won't be necessary, although I'm pretty sure Futaba would want to. Robbie Ragnarok, not more than an hour in, and he's already adopted her, so who's the mom? You already know who the mom is! Oh, yes, yes, yes. Show me, show me. <laughs> Futaba! Get down a notch, okay? You can see it after we get through these questions. First off, why were you in the metaverse? I do not know, because my mother was there. Could you have the AI version of amnesia or something? That seems difficult to recover from. Uh, if your data just crashed, I could take a look and try restoring it. Yay! It is impossible. I have already tried every potential solution. <laughs> yeah, based on your specs, I guess it's not surprising you already thought of that. Oh. Can you recall anything at all? Only the command I received at initialization. You don't sound too sure of that. Be humanity's companion. That was the command I was issued. I remember nothing else. Don't worry about it. Yeah, don't let it bother you too much, Sophia. But you come out of that corner right now and you mingle with our daughter! I was in the exact same situation when I first met these guys. Yugi! Whoa, showing source code at first meeting? You got a dirty one. Oh my god. Definitely takes after her adopted mom Futaba. Futaba is not the fu No! Bun is! Buns! Thank you. I've still got a shit ton of questions about Sophia, but we have some real work to do first. Right. The metaverse. And what we saw. From what you saw, that means Alice Hiragi has a palace in Shibuya, right? Yeah, and she's, um, interesting. Yeah, she was calling herself the queen, being all high and mighty, ordering shadows around. All that kind of shit. And stepping on me. Don't forget stepping on me. Did you mention that she stepped on me? There's no doubt that was the cognitive world, but something about it was awfully different from the palaces. What is it? Real humans were being attacked by shadows. Yeah, that's new. That's kind of fucked up. There were people inside the palace? Yeah, real people. And they took, like, a big red chaos emerald out of them. You mean they had access to the Metaverse Navigator? Not quite. 
But that disappeared for all of us. Yeah, that whole thing with Emma, actually. I know, right? That's where this comes in. You mean Emma? Yeah, I know! Weird, right? Yugi, thanks so much, dude. Kagato, clearly she has two mothers in-game mom who is Bun's alter ego and actual Bun. Holy shit, that actually... That actually works. That actually makes sense. Holy shit, that makes sense! Yep, for some reason, this thing worked just like the MetaNav did. Alright, so... She's both Joker and Futaba's daughter, as well as mine and Bun's. We accidentally entered Alice's Emma keyword and got sent to the metaverse. Wait, that means Emma is dangerous. But you can just uninstall it. The meta nav didn't work like that. There's one more thing that's been bothering me. When we got back to this world, Emma said we returned from the jail. Jail? The only thing we figured out is that this new place is called a jail. So, could you guys check out the palace or jail or whatever with us? Good point. There's no progressing any further unless we see it with our own eyes. I'm also having a hard time buying Alice as the ruler of a palace. Are we going to scout it out together? I think the sooner the better. Yes, let's all go together. Is it even safe for us to enter though? What if we all just end up captured? There were no enemies in the vicinity of the exit. It's fine to enter through there. Well, are we going to head back to that place tomorrow? Tomorrow? Sounds like a plan. Right, we've got our mission. Very well. I look forward to seeing this jail. Let's say we meet at the connecting bridge in Shibuya. But first... Yes, Futaba Baba? I get to see Sophia's code. You promised, remember? Oh my god. Oh, this is gonna be the info dump of a lifetime. I promise, you won't feel a thing. <laughs> Don't violate our daughter! Are you confident this is wise? I'm not confident at all. <laughs> I guess so. I mean, at least we know she's got computer skills. <sighs> Man, this is what happens when we get back together. Oh, talk about an ass-busting summer vacation. Well, Ryuji, I thought you liked being a phantom thief. Get all the girls, right? What is it? Did your stomach growl? What about our life-changing Kyoto excursion? Our barbecue extravaganza? Oh god, yes, he's hungry! He's hungry for food! Extravaganza? You mean our camping trip? It looks like we'll just have to postpone it. <gasps> oh no! Don't tell him that! He's been holding out for so long for a real food! Slice you to ribbons. Oh shit! He's getting serious. Aha. You can't slice the metaverse, dude. Just save it for the shadows. He's got oof. Oof. Yusuke's fired up now. Yusuke needs food. Man, could today have been any more drama packed? I don't know, I was having fun. We really ought to have the time to poke around at Sophia once we have the time for it. I keep on hitting this. Yes, I do keep hitting that thing. Checking tutorials. You can check tutorials you have seen before and other Wait. Wait. Oh, wait. Futaba, your... Your trench coat actually has a slit in the back? Oh, even Futaba wants to show off some leg. Brayden Patterson, thank you so much, dude. Emma is a man-made meta nap. That is terrifying. That's right, circle. Hmm, I see. If? What? If? But how? I mean, with this over here? If? Damn, so that's it. You're leaving me in the dark here. Futaba's really gotten into analyzing Sophia. So what do you think, Futaba? How's Sophia's code look? Well, her programmer is a genius. No doubt about that. You can figure a person out by their code, and not just their skill level. Their habits, thought processes, even their personalities are there. This code is so advanced that even I can't read it and comprehend it right away. 
It'll take me weeks, even months, to actually grasp how Sophia works. Wow. You have that much time? Take you months? Ooh, that's a serious program. I don't understand. Do you mean I'm impressive? Very. Yeah, you're impressive. You're some kind of super AI. If you ever went public, everyone would call Emma old hat. Old hat? <laughs> uh, basically, yesterday's news, nobody wants to use anymore, you're awesome. When something was popular at one point but stopped being popular, it becomes old hat. It's a saying people don't really use anymore. Oh, uh, uh, well. Okay, I've got it. You are very knowledgeable, Futaba. Don't go teaching her too much weird stuff, okay? While we're at it, did you see anything about Sophia's past? Her programmer's name? Or a company's, maybe? <sighs> Nothing yet. And most of those leave a signature of some sort in their work, too. <sighs> anyway, I'm gonna keep cracking at it from home. I'll let you know once I find anything new. Just take care of her, okay? I can walk you home. I'm good. It's just around the block. But, but, look, Futaba, let's be real here. For whatever reason, your outfit's growing on me, and you're you're looking really, really cute right now. I just want to walk you home! Well, folks, time for me to make like a tree. She made like a tree? And a leaf. Axel Firemania, thank you so much, dude. At work, have some cash. Sorry, I can't be here a lot to watch, but work's been killing me. Have fun hacking and slashing. Dude, thank you so much, man, and don't overwork yourself, okay? Be safe out there. Boy, was that a hell of a day. Uh, you've got no idea. I never would have imagined something like this would happen. I just wanted to have fun! <laughs> I know, but we don't have a choice. We'll cut loose once things are set. Robert and Karen, I just wanted to have fun, but then the mean metaverse came back and then we got chatted to deal with where. Well, the metaverse reappearing may have been a surprise, but even that doesn't compare with Sophia. Yeah, no kidding. Oh! Did you call for me? I need to restrain from the Sophia in the pants jokes. I need to restrain myself. We were just talking about how you're a huge mystery. And a huge darling. Says the talking cat. <laughs> Damn! She learned how to do comebacks too. You've been hanging around Ryuji, I see. Eh, uh, good point. Take that from some mystery app. <laughs> By the way, how does some top of the line program lose all its memory, huh? I mean, AI are supposed to be super smart, right? That is. inarguably true. Aw, don't get too down over it. I am humanity's companion. If I am not helpful, then I am useless. You are helpful, you are very helpful, you, you will always be helpful. Always, always, always helpful. Don't be so hard on yourself. At least you remember that much, right? Right. I think that means it's important. But is being helpful all you'll do to become a good companion? Is that not how it works? There's a bit more to that. Please explain. How else can one be a companion? Huh? Well, uh... <laughs> uh, that's, uh... Well, let me butt in and actually explain something to you. If you want to be an amazing companion, here's what you should not do. Never tell your friends when they should or should not go to bed. Morgana. I guess you just have to find a way to understand the human heart. Hearts? Uh, right. Then you'll be able to empathize with other people and be a good companion to them. I guess. The human heart. Look, just, just don't worry about it. All you need to do is join us and learn from all the kinds of people we need. Oh, that's a good idea. In exchange, you lend a hand to the Phantom Thieves. So I guess you could call this a deal? Okay. That is a decent deal. Especially since it should help me become a good companion for humanity. 
Yep. So long as it's good with our leader. Work that AI magic. Okay, I'll do that. Then it's a deal. Glad to have you on board, Sophia. Yay! We've got plenty of scouting to do tomorrow. We should get some rest. Okay. Good night, Morgana. What about me? I know the text says it, but what about me? Quiet, everyone. Anne's butt is talking. We went back to our former hideout in Shibuya to check out the jail together. Great. Everyone's here. We're going to be infiltrating the jail. Are we ready? Yeah! We've done this many a time. I can't imagine anyone being phased by this. <laughs> yeah, bro! Bring it! We're very short on intel, so we need to be cautious. We'll just scout the general area for this trip. We use Emma to enter, right? Is there anything special we need to do? Um, no, we just opened the app and said the right keyword. Find the right name in Emma's search results, then enter the correct keyword on the friend request screen. Yeah, you got it, Futaba. Ah, leave it to the super hacker to explain this stuff. That had nothing to do with hacking. Even you should know how to explain it. <laughs> All that's left is to choose our point of entry. That was actually, okay. I was actually watching Ryuji's expression, and the animators of this game did a really great job. Because at first he was acting all excited, and he had a big smile on his face, his eyebrows were raised. And then as soon as Futaba was like, even you can explain that, it was just a subtle change, but you could see the disappointment in his face. And it was so good. There will be no enemies in the area from which we escaped yesterday. Upon reaching the relevant location, you will only need to speak the keyword. Seems all that's left is to trust Sophia and see where she leads us. Now let's do this thing. Wonderland! The gang's all here this time. Well... Did we make it? Kinda sorta, I think. Maybe, yes. Oh, your Phantom Thief attire. Yeah, you do. Oh, I've forgotten this feeling. The fusion of form and function. Truly magnificent. Oh boy. Look, it's Beauty Thief. My name is Beauty Thief. Oh my god! <laughs> Let's not fool around here. I admit, though, these clothes do bring back some memories. <laughs> They're having fun with it again. We can reminisce later. Take a look at that view. Uh, of course, then Makoto has to be Buzz Killington the third. So, this is the jail? Just what is that building? This place is bonkers. Futaba, look, that's a castle. We've seen one already. I know you weren't there. But we've seen some pretty unique places. I mean, have you forgotten that you were in a pyramid and your uh, and uh, Haru's dad was in outer space? Nothing escapes the atrocious color scheme of this place. It looks like that because of someone's cognition, correct? Right. Most likely Alice's. The distortion has to be exceptionally strong there for a reason. So you're saying that's the stronghold of the Queen ruling over this jail? Its appearance certainly fits the notion. The buildings around here still look pretty normal, though. Looks like that place over there has a limited range of distortion. The first time we came here, we entered by the crossing down there. That's where we saw a group of cop shadows taking stuff out of people's chests. Oh, you mean that jewel we saw? The hell was up with that? They were collecting the Chaos Emeralds, apparently. That may have been a desire. Yeah, about that. Yo, Phantom Thieves. Oh my god, that's her actual greeting from here on out. I love it. Ah, Sophia! Holy crap, an actual AI in human form! Futaba's gonna pounce that run! Wow, you're so cute, Sophia. I know, right? Such a 
fascinating form you've taken. I can't stop staring at the beautifully curved lines. Yusuke, no, back off! I've never seen an outfit like that. Can I try floofing it? Oh my god. Floofing? You know, like Haru's hair. I think she wants to get a feel for the fabric of your clothes while hugging you, Sophia. Oh my god. Request denied. I am neither a child nor a pet. But I wanted to adopt you. Uh, no floofing. Oh, no adopting! By the by, how does H work for an AI? Not right now. Sophia, tell us more about the desire you mentioned. That is the term used by shadows here. They say things such as, seize their desires, and we must offer these desires to the monarch. Based on their language and behavior, I speculate the aforementioned jewel was in fact a desire. That does make sense. When we saw Alice here, she mentioned desires too. So if Alice is the monarch, then she really is the ruler of this jail. But these desires, are they actually made up of the things people desire? Seizing desires of all things. What use would they have for those? Finding out what happened to the folks who got jumped could tell us something. Where could those victims be now? I don't see a place from here where they may be held. I don't know. Maybe they're being held somewhere else. Say, about those people you witnessed being attacked, are you sure they were humans? What do you mean? Uh? Well, couldn't they have been shadows or something? If there are humans getting captured and imprisoned in this jail right now, wouldn't there be a huge commotion in our world? Groups of people going missing out of the blue. Oh shit, you're right. Now there's a point. I haven't heard a peep about that online. Wait a minute, maybe that has something to do with what was talked about at that police meeting at the beginning of the game, where all those people were affected much like the Phantom Thieves were? Uh, affecting people, but we weren't in business anymore at the time. Now, all of a sudden, people's desires are being taken, and therefore they're acting. It says their treasures are being taken. That's what's going on. Their treasures are being taken. So their desires are being taken, which are making them do that kind of stuff. Now I'm getting it. Now I'm getting it. And Bud says, "Hun, we are still adopting child or not." <laughs> So, no one is actually disappearing from reality? Okay, so real people are being brought in. It is essentially their cognitive forms, but still, their desires are being taken. I get it now. I see. Shadows. What are shadows? A shadow's the parts of you suppressed within your subconscious. It's basically just your other self. Does that mean their main selves are all right? No. The shadow and the actual self are two sides of the same coin. So if a desire is taken from someone's shadow, what happens to the person in reality? I gotta say, I'm getting a bad vibe from all this. Are they trying to influence reality by doing something to the shadows? Then how are we to act? This sounds like a crisis. Shouldn't we rescue the victims right away? Wait a second. Is somebody using this metaverse to mass produce palace leaders, to steal desires from everybody in order to somehow create some kind of weird utopia where everyone has th their desires taken away? Is that what's going on here? Somebody using the idea behind the Phantom Thieves to essentially do it to everybody? No, that was just speculation. After all, We've only witnessed the cognitive world side of things. Until we find out how all this is affecting the real world, we can only know half of what's going on. I'd say the first thing we need to do is investigate Alice and her victims. Plus, if we make the wrong move in the cognitive world, there's a chance the ruler could have a shutdown in the real world. Right. We need to get the story straight before we make any real moves or we'll just be doing damage. Let's see. <laughs> Let's look at the catching suit. No, I'm no, no. I'm not falling into Morgana's influence. Let's look at Alice. Got it. Uh, but what are we gonna do? 
Crashing some random store opening probably only works once. Let's say we get into that once we're out of here. Okay, let's get out of here. <sighs> so we're leaving already? Come on, I want to fight more. A fight. I'm beating sharp. That was easy, I guess. Mission accomplished. Well, we've confirmed the presence of the jail. Next, we look into Alice and any potential victims. And how do we do that? Look into what? The usual rumor mills. Looking for anything about Alice. Gossip about her being abusive or other messed up stuff. Good idea. Let's gather any intel that we can, both online and on the streets. Should we, you know, maybe consult the fan site? That should technically still be up and working, right? <sighs> I've got the web crawling covered. Or t don't tell me that the fan site's done. But if we're ever to gain conclusive proof of any rumors, I believe we'll need direct access to her at some point. Direct access to a pop star sounds awfully tough. Uh, uh, about that. I may get to meet Alice tomorrow. Oh, God. Okay, on your acting skills, don't use them. What? For real? Take a shot. Ow. Take that shot. Well, I had asked the modeling agency's president if I could meet her sometime. I heard she'd be on a TV show filming nearby, so I asked if I could visit the set. I was hoping to learn from her by watching her in action. I gave up on it after making plans with you guys, but I might be able to get the ball rolling again in time. The timing's nothing short of kismet. Yeah, way to go, Lady On. Hooray for plot! But I'm not making any promises about it. And there's no way we'd get to approach her either. Plus, our full group's just too big. The most I could even ask to bring is just one more person. Haha. Uh -huh. I think I was just volunteered. Well, that settles that. We are counting on you. Whoopee! Give Alice shit when you meet her so you can get some evidence out of her. Damn, seriously? How? Ooh, I cannot wait. <laughs> hey, you better not be thinking of trying anything funny. I'm the one who will suffer for it. Yeah, that's true. If Odd brings me and I cause a ruckus, then Odd will be in trouble and I like Odd way too much for that to happen. I think I'll tag along with you. We'll be fine so long as no one sees me. For today, let's focus on her potential victims. Let's go. Looks like everyone's out gathering intel already. Let's not fall behind. Talking and examining. Approach people and press circle to speak to them and listen in on conversations to get information related to the monarch. Intel can also be gathered from sources other than people. Local shops may sometimes have valuable information on the monarch as well. So not just talk to NPCs, but go into all the shops. All of them. So we'll start with Futababa. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, too many people. Can't do it. I wanna go home. Yikes, are you okay, Futaba? I thought you said school and gone you used to crowds. I underestimated the certification edition of Sabuya. The swarm of par partiers is just too much for me. Uh... Oh my god, I need to hug her right now. I need to hug Futaba! And even ignoring that, going up to people I don't know and eavesdropping on them or pumping them for intel is way out of my league. I'll take care of it. That's true. He's right. Leave this to us. You've got the online front locked down, Futaba. This should be helpful. Oh, that's right. You can help out. I can lend you a hand, Futaba. We can both lock down the online front. Ooh, thanks, Sophia. Time to join forces as a cyber sleuth tag team. Okay, I'll help however you like. And nice recruiting, Futaba. We're counting on you two. Thanks. Thanks for talking to me, guys. I'm feeling a little more comfortable out here now. Oh, hey, why don't you take this, Kagado, for helping me out? 
may aid you on your quest for intel. I got salty papaya. I got salty papaya. Oh my god, Akechi no. Akechi no. Some investigations, huh? Sure you could use an ace detective? Ace defective, more like. Ah! Wait. Is that a Yusuke? That's a Yusuke. That's a wild Yusuke. Let's go talk to the wild Yusuke. Hi, Yusuke. Now this is more popular than I had imagined. I wouldn't be able to avoid hearing people speak to her, not speak of her, even if I wanted to. So Alice in Wonderland. I admit, it's an intriguing and visually striking space to work with as an artist. Oh, well then that's it. Well, uh, thank Alice, make me your slave. Oh my god. Ooh, used books. Hmm. Looks like there isn't anything here about the rumors surrounding Alice. We'll just have to ask around. I want to be just like Alice! I can't stop thinking about her. I just love her so much. Maybe the mm. statue knows something. The statue of the loyal dog, Buchiko. Dogs aren't human, but could they still be considered humanity's companion? What they are doesn't matter. The most important thing is trusting each other. Damn. I'll do my best. Hello, I'm right in front of Uchiko. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, 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 fine. I have a phone call. Axel, thanks so much, dude. Folks, both the final and secret bosses poking us both. Might be at work, but listening in causes screw. <laughs> Dude, I think I found someone that was in the jail. Can you come to the alley behind the airsoft shop? Yeah, she's not Ooh. Yes, Ryuji, you rang. Hey. Check out the guy with the brown hair. Wasn't he Alice's thing? I can't believe it. Uh, which one? They both have brown hair. Come on, man, I need money, please. You again? I just lent you money for all your Alice obsessed bullshit. I know, but there's a new Alice original coming out and I really, really need it. Like, I won't even be able to think or breathe if I don't get it. The guy with the brown hair. It's the same guy we saw before, right? Dude, why are you suddenly obsessed over some random ass idol in the first place? Are you serious though? You actually went to a loan shark? I can't believe you. So he's borrowing from shady lenders only to get shady merchandise in return? That ain't normal. And didn't the other guy say he suddenly got obsessed? Could it be the influence of the metaverse? We got gather rumors. Okay, we got mm -hmm. something. Oh, 46%. Okay. Hmm. Temp temporarily closed? That means the Y's not here. I figured a Y would know about Shibuya, but there's not much we can do if he's not here. Oh, this is so awesome. Y, where'd you go? Why? Why, oh, why? Pancakes! Pancakes! Ah! Akechi, where are you? Akechi, I know you're around right here! Somebody! Oh, I know you're around right here somewhere, Akechi! Mother shot. Welcome. Alice Haragi? Oh, do you mean the Alice clothing line? Why, yes, we do carry it. But I'm so sorry, we're all sold out. We only put them out ten minutes ago, but the fans came in and swiped them all up. Like PlayStation 5s. I'm so sorry that you missed it. Maybe you can purchase some from some scalpers online. <laughs> really? Wow, gone in 10 minutes? I guess it's possible, but those fans have some dedication to buy it out so fast. Let's be sure to remember this. All right, damn. On. On. You don't need to. Non crepes. I think I've said this before, but you're not really a crepe person, are you? But I'm not trying to talk to the crepes, I'm trying to talk to Aunt. 
I knew people went crazy for her stuff, but this is something else. I keep hearing stories about relationships going south, even folks ending up hospitalized for exhaustion, and Alice's name always comes up. Could she really have something to do with all of it? But how and why? Oh, yeah. I guess there's no point getting stressed over it now. Oh, I know. Are you hungry? No good ideas on an empty stomach, you know. I'm going to grab a crepe and start a brainstorm. Yay! I already know. Oh, my God. She's adorable. I already know which kind I want. Extra chocolate and extra whipped cream. Ooh, and maybe I'll have to have strawberries. <laughs> That's pretty much. Well, it's fine. I'm just going to work out extra later. Oh, my God. Level-headed girl. Alice? Of course I've heard of her. Everyone in class has. Especially the boys. They love her. My friend's boyfriend even went as far as breaking off their relationship. All because he took a sudden interest in Alice. Ooh. Bun, I have... You have a crepe maker at home? I have... A confession to make. I have not had a crepe in 20 years. I would like to have one at some time. I don't care if it is just a very, very, very thin pancake. It is a crepe. It will be known as crepe. It will be called crepe. Nothing. I know she's cute and all, but cute enough to leave somebody behind. Yeah, that's really extreme. Haru! I peeked into a store at 705 a few minutes ago, and all the customers had an invitation card. Her number of friends is probably increasing as we speak. Isn't that ridiculous? Karaoke! We can't really ask around in here. Let's try somewhere else. Maybe something at Big Bang Burger knows. Welcome to Big Bang Burger, open 24 hours a day because there's no day or night in space. How can I help you? Oh my god, I can actually buy Big Bang Burgers here. Oh, yes. Come back soon. I won't buy it now, but I will later. Dedicated woman. Alice, is this an interview or something? Sorry, but I hate her guts. Go ask someone else. Alice is the type who toys with people's lives. She only cares about fans lining her pockets. Arcade? <laughs> what is this place? It looks interesting. So shiny. This arcade's usually empty. We probably won't get much information here. Convenience store. Hi, welcome. Our meat buns are always fresh and piping hot. Would you like my beet bun? We've got whatever Wait, 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 wait. No, I want to learn more about... Again. Now I don't want to buy stuff right now. All right. Are you ready to order? Right, Come back right, anytime. Right. No. I want pancake. No! Adachi. Adachi. It's catchy. Go away. <laughs> Oh my god! So, Dragon Like a Yakuza is finally out. Yakuza Like a Dragon! The game Yakuza Like a Dragon. Ugh. Dragon Like a Yakuza is finally out. <sighs> I can't just go by myself, though. Makoto! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it, Makoto! Why are there so many awesome things about you? But you're such a wet fucking blanket! <laughs> <laughs> ah! Thinking about playing hooky? Huh? How long have you been there? It's something like that. The poster just caught my eyes all. Anyway, I heard quite a few employees at the theater were let, uh, were let go all of a sudden. And the rumor is it's all because they weren't fans of Alice. What's that about? Wow, that sucks. No one gets fired for such an absurd reason without something going on behind the scenes. I can't it. Let's see, pharmacy? Check no. Out. Thanks. Not buying anything right now. Let's see. 
already they're there. Hmm? Already did that. Uh huh. Wait, who haven't I talked? Who? They have talked to On. But wait, 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 wait. Odds is not grayed out. See you later. Once I've had my brain food, I'll get back to gathering intel and putting it all together. Stay hydrated, okay, Kakadu? It's a hot fun. Okay, now she's grayed out. Oh, Ryuji. At first, I figured he might be one of them in front of the whacked out look in his eyes, but yep, ain't no mistake, that kind of crazy. Damn it. That dude in front of the Buchika was acting pretty much the same, right? No way that's a coincidence. Nicholas Snyder, thank you so much, dude. I make crepes. If we end up meeting, I'll make you some. Yeah, crepes! She's not that great. Honestly, Odd's got the right idea. I'll take the chocolate chips and strawberries, too. <laughs> See if there's anything in Station Square that I might have missed. Oh, Futaba has another thing to say. Okay, Sophia, send me all the data you can find on any aberrational behavior reported in the area recently. Start with the last two weeks. Leave it to me. Got it. I'll send them your way in just a moment. Best of luck with the analysis, Futaba. Baba Baba. Okay. Can I go down here? So. Let's see. No, no, no. Can't go down there. Maybe in here. Hey. No. All right. Uh huh. Down here. No, can't go down there. Hmm. Base of operations. Smoky area, oh. maybe? Look at all the puffy smoke. It must be hard being crammed into such a small area. All right, uh, we're missing something. Uh, you guys, no, nothing, okay. Ha. Huh. Bookstore, maybe? Hey, hey. Bookstores in the city have so much more variety. It's a shame we don't have time to read right now. Okay. Vending machines, mm -hmm. maybe? No? That already maybe down here. So maybe. Awesome. No. Alright. Um no, I already went there. We already did. Maybe down this way? Hey, hey! No. Oof. Oh wait, maybe Makoto has another thing to say. I'm going to ask around a little more about it. Let me know when you're calling it a day and we can regroup. What else is there? All right, I'm gonna go and hit up the shops again. Just be sure, okay, that one didn't give me anything. I know this one didn't give me anything. Neither this one, because those are shops where I'm actually buying stuff. Okay, that's Big Big Burger. All right. I already checked that out. This guy by the statue checked by the gym. I checked the guys at the statue. There wasn't anybody there, but uh, I guess I'll check by the gym. Hmm? Uh. Nope. 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 No. Check the statue. Um. Uh, yep, more about Buchiko. Huh. Maybe back through here? Shibuya so. Station? No. There's a grumbling guy at the airsoft. Okay. Oh, 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 oh! 
Alice, you're so freaking adorable. No one could ever compare you. I'll, I'll do anything for you. Buy you fancy jewelry. Take you out to the finest restaurants. I'd sign my life over to you if I could. Hmm? Woo, the sipping is strong with this one. Thank you, chat. That was a big help. I was, I did not actually notice the grumble. I was looking for the speech bubbles over people's heads. But I've technically got, I guess, technically grumble grumble is a speech bubble. <laughs> this guy's completely lost it. It's like he can't even see us. I've heard of being crazy for someone, but this is way too far. 100%! That literally was it. Yay! How's the information search going? Why don't we meet up and share what we've gathered so far? What are you gonna do? Hmm, Makoto's got a good point. Should we gather everyone up? Yes, let's That's do true. it. All right, then let's go meet up at the connecting bridge. So how'd it go? Anyone learn anything useful about potential victims? They're all simps for her now. Yeah, we spotted a couple familiar faces. We found some of the people who were attacked in the jail. You really found them? Which means the ones ambushed in the jail were indeed only their shadows and not their human forms. But there's still one thing. They're all acting real weird. Weird how? They're all totally crazy for Alice. They're even getting loans so they can buy more shit at her store. That's pretty weird. Hmm. Now that you mention it, I saw others behaving similarly in Shibuya. Yeah, like this one couple nearly splitting up when the boyfriend bought everything Alice related he could find. Wow. There were even people let go from their jobs because they weren't Alice fans themselves. Yeah, that happened at the movie theater. I've even found some reports of Alice fans straight up assaulting outspoken critics of hers. At first, I figured Alice was just the latest fad, but this seems so much worse than that. Maybe the people who had the desires taken from them went crazy. If that's the case, then we have to do something. Agreed. If such aberrant behavior continues to rise, we could easily find ourselves in an unwinnable position. With the metaverse involved, we're the only people who can stop this. Mm-hmm. We have to help. Looks like you've finished gathering intel on Alice's victims. I certainly did. Would you like to investigate her next? Uh, yell deck, yeah, that's right. Gotta go and actually investigate Alice herself. Nicholas Snyder, thank you so much, dude. Gotta go, let me know when you want crepes. Okay, thank you so much. Yep, let's break for today and pick this back up tomorrow after your trip. No, they did not change Ann's voice actress. They're all the same, they're all the same. If anyone was changed, then the new person is so good, I can't tell the difference. Good luck with the Alice visit, you three. Thanks. We're on it. I made my way back to LeBlanc. Thursday! Oh, heading out? Don't be too late coming back. For a second there, with that suit, and a little bit of the hair, I gotta admit, I'm afraid that was a catchy again. Mm. Boss, this curry is fantastic. That's the guy I think is funny! Okay, we got a detective in here, but somebody that I like. Oh, thanks. A certain TV studio, filming location. So, this is going out live, huh? Oh, it's this place again! Speaking of a catchy. Even I'm starting to get a little nervous. You still good? Hey, stay in the bag. If they find out we brought a pet in here, they'll kick us out. A pet? Oh, Morgan is not a pet. He's a valuable member of- I don't think you're a pet. <laughs> God damn it, Akechi! Oh, you never know where I'll turn up. God damn it! Akechi! Behave yourself in there. Quiet, quiet on the set. <laughs> uh, well, I guess if I can't be seen, you two do your best to blend in too. Mumble, mumble, mumble. Thanks, Akechi. We're fine. 
All we're gonna do is watch. Should I also make efforts to blend in? You already blend in, you're a phone. Yeah, just hang tight for a bit, Sophia. No prob. Ooh, here she comes. Miss Alice on the set! Oh god, how many people in here are gonna crowd her? Ah! Is adorable. On, on. Focus, focus. Evil. Cutting back from commercial. Back in five, four, three. And now, on to the hottest meet and greet segment of the show. We have a special guest with us today. She has taken the fashion world by storm and conquered it. Please welcome the designer, Alice Hiragi. Um, she's taking the fashion world by storm. Like I said, her clothes look like she jumped in all the sherbet. Uh, thanks for having me. <laughs> Thank you for joining us, Alice. You sure have been keeping busy these days, haven't you? It's only thanks to all my fans that I've been able to do what I do. And Magus 7, thank you so much, dude. I just want some bite of the ice cream. Fucking hell. And what a number of fans you have. Talk about strong support. Am I wrong to presume that you designed the outfit you're wearing today? It's hideous! It's just so cute. Very expressive. Uh. <laughs> Thank you so much! The theme of my current line is Alice in Wonderland. <laughs> oh, yeah, don't she? I feel like fashion is a rare and beautiful thing that can take anyone into a world built on their dreams. You can find a side to yourself that maybe you didn't even know you had. Fashion can do so much for us. I shouldn't really say anything about it because I have terrible fashion sense. <laughs> I try my hardest to focus on that whenever I design a new piece. Such wise words from a successful industry veteran. What inspiration originally spurred you into fashion design, if you don't mind? <laughs> to be honest, I was very shy growing up. I didn't have any friends at school. I would get so lonely. I wanted to change so much, but I just couldn't figure out how to do it. Then, one day, I saw the most beautiful dress in a shop window. When I put it on, the whole world felt new. It was like I was hit with this blinding ray of light. I really can change. That's what wearing it made me think. I strive each day to give that same feeling to every person who tries on one of my designs. I want to give that ray of light to others. That's what inspired me to enter the fashion industry. Honestly, if it were for the fact that she's a manipulative bitch, that uh, she has some uh, good words to share. Really? Huh. <laughs> now I can see why the young people love you so much. How do you handle all the dating rumors? Uh, cheerful host. What was that little lag at the end there? Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, what? Uh, <laughs> uh oh. What's going on? I don't get it. Is this some kind of scripted thing? I wonder what's wrong. His desires were taken and he's going to try and yeah, here we go. Are you okay? Alice, I... I love you, Alice. Please, spend your life with me. Yeah, I knew it. Here we go. Here we go. What? <laughs> hey. What is all this? I didn't realize until now. I love you. Oh my god. Uh, this is really out of the blue. All right, stop it. <laughs> yeah, this bit's going on a little too long. I mean it. I can't live without you. Cut the feed. Cut the feed. Got a commercial. What in the hell? And what about me, asshole? Oh, well, shit. Is this real? Apparently so. Those two were engaged already, right? Wow, what a train wreck. I can't believe this. Cut the commercial! Now! 
Damn, really? It took you that long? I'm begging you, Alice, please! <laughs> <laughs> this is so dumb. Just shut up already. What has happened to you? What is this mess? <laughs> oh, yeah, she totally knows what's up. They canceled filming on the spot and escorted everyone off the set. That... That was actually live on TV, right? Can't believe he spilled his beans like that. Even I thought he went overboard with it. Yeah, no kid. Jeez, fell right on his hands and knees immediately. So, then do you think that host had his desire taken by Alice? Yep. Maybe. Like, what kind of professional host would do that on live TV? True. It didn't seem like he was in his right frame of mind. Like he wasn't even there, and someone else was controlling him. Morgana, that's it! I don't know if all this is right, but his personality changed like when someone's heart was stolen. After the treasure... Exactly! I knew it! I was right! Maybe Alice can control anyone whose desire she steals. If the desire is turned over to the ruler, they wind up under their control. Like with Alice. I see would really explain it amazing as always lady on but that would mean alice really is guilty she's brainwashing people she's taking people yep alice really is guilty yeah looks like it <laughs> alice said she wants to be a ray of light for people that's what i've always wanted too i read about her in a magazine once and i just really felt where she was coming from. It's why I asked to come to the show in the first place. I wanted to see her in person. Well, when I go beat her up, I'm bringing on with me. But now, I wonder if that was all just... Lady on. Let on go full on dominatrix on her. Like, I'll show you what a real dominatrix does. <laughs> Man, that was great. That was... Alice? Quick, hide! Uh, where? Miss Alice, this is a public hall. Please, you must keep your voice down. Nice hiding spot there, buddy. Eh, it's fine. See? No one in sight. No one could possibly be coming around the corners! <laughs> anyway, though, did you see that lady's face? She totally lost it up there. All those cushy, talking head types make the best faces when things finally stop going their way. Miss Alice, do you think you could stop doing these things? Huh? What do you mean? I was the victim on stage. Oh, she's pulling that card. <laughs> what is it that you want me to stop doing? I... I don't know how you're doing it or why, but after seeing that, there has to be something. You... Oh, so you want me to punish you again? Uh-huh. Ah, please, I'm sorry. Oh, oops. What a terrible accident. Just like what happened on set. A terrible accident. I'm still upset over it too, you know. Isn't it your job to take my side? Or are you asking to end up broken like my last manager? Do you want to get stuck up in your room like he is? I really don't like her. Ugh. Well, it doesn't matter anyway. I don't want toys that don't do as they're told. Stop! Then beg me to forgive you until it hurts as much as you hurt me with your words. Why don't you do what you did yesterday? Bravo with your face all messed up with snot. I'll take another video if you'd like. Oh shit, seriously? Come on, Ben. Do it, do it. I'm not gonna stop until you do, got it? <sighs> okay guys, now's your time to turn the corner! Hey, the guy sounds like he's in real pain. If she doesn't cut it out. Hey, stop! And who is this? 
Cut the sadistic crap. It was way too far. You said you wanted to be a ray of light for people. How the hell does that help? <sighs> Oops! Caught the act! It's almost like you were in a public fucking area, you stupid bitch! Yeah, bullshit. Weren't we? Yeah. So you'll go get the car now? Oh, hey, wait! Hang on. Uh, are you on Takamaki? <laughs> I paid money to see Alice and Kamashita together. Oh my god. <laughs> well, you know who I am? Yeah! I know all the models. I read every fashion magazine the day it comes out. Actually, I really admire you. Would you like to be friends? Oh, yeah, she's trying to... <laughs> she's totally trying to trap Anne. Uh, trap on and take her desires. Yep. <laughs> like, oh, yeah, let's totally be friends. <laughs> oh, Bun. Bun says, you know, Kamashita was bad, but we never got to see this actual abuse. This. This. Yeah, see... Wrong! Obviously, you got Emma, right? <laughs> My keyword is. Don't bother. I'd never accept someone who treats another person like that. Aw, too bad. But I do appreciate honesty. So, how about you? Would you like to be friends? Already are. I'm passing too. Aw, two in a row. Yeah, I know. Sucks, don't it? Hey, hang on. You were at 705 the other day. Yeah! Didn't you? I was! Interesting, ain't it? We're done here. Let's go. Ah, <sighs> that's a bummer. But I know I gave him one of my cards. Why doesn't he obey? Because I'm too awesome for that! And I'm taken! And then I stormed out and we came back here. Sorry about that, by the way. I was just so upset. No, on um, that was awesome. No apology needed. You did a fantastic job finding out about Alice. Seriously, back when I played Persona 5 and I rejected on um, that was seriously a very, very, very hard thing for me to do because I really, really, really like her. I just like Futaba and Haru more. But... Damn, she's good! Yeah, it's all thanks to you, Lady On. I, I really care about what she stands for. Once Lady On had her on the ropes, she whipped out her phone and tried adding them all on Emma right away. From what we saw, she might know that she can use Emma to lure people into her jail. She gets them into her jail, then takes their desires so they'll do what she says. I suspect she's been doing this for a while now. I see. That does explain things. But what is her end goal? I can't imagine such awful behavior actually doing her any good. Is it the same as with Kamoshida? <laughs> Somebody else made the connection! <laughs> Holy shit, yeah! That's a good point. Ugh, she seemed to be having a blast being such an awful person. I know, and that's what really pisses me off. Kamashita, what basically he knew he was doing terrible things and he was having an awesome time throwing his position around. That's what made him just such a slimy individual that you wanted to beat up. So yeah, this girl's doing a uh, this game's doing a great job at making me want to beat the hell out of the first boss. <laughs> Whatever it is, she has the gall to set up that kind of tragedy on live TV. She isn't in her right mind anymore. The longer we leave this be, the more victims that pile up. And it's already gotten to be quite a pile. Now's the time to act. But just how should we act? Is there a treasure in her jail? That's the tricky part. I am picking up a faint scent of something treasure-like, but... What is a treasure? It's the condensed core of a ruler's desires. That's what gives birth to a palace and powers it. 
Usually, we just take the treasure to trigger a change of heart in our target. Hmm, that's interesting. What if there is no treasure there? We can't change Alice's heart. There has to be treasure. For now, let's focus on tracking the treasure-like scent Morgana mentioned. That should at least put us on the trail for clues. Question. Why must we change Alice's heart? Why? Because she's hurting people. So Alice only needs to be stopped. Changing her heart is unnecessary. No, beating her shadow won't help. Worst case scenario, it could wind up causing her to die in the real world. Death. That is an acceptable outcome. I like her. <laughs> well, Sophia, it's official. 100% now, you are adopted. Congratulations. You are now Jirai. Dude, that's... I know. Stone cold, don't care. I'm humanity's companion. I'm supposed to determine the best choices for humanity. Alice Hiraki makes people suffer every day. We should ensure she stops this as soon as possible. Why not do so? Uh, let's see. Matsuri Suri, welcome to Super Boss Dude and Axel Firemania. Thank you so much. Hey, boss man, I know I have no reason to ask, but I've yet to find out your last play at Persona 5, so please, no spoilers. I believe I'm at Shido's Cruci. Oh. I sorry. She has to own up to her crimes. I do not understand. I want to understand, but I cannot. Where is the flaw in my logic? I do see where you're coming from, Sophia. Alice is doing horrible things. We could just help all those people without caring what happens to her. The metaverse is serious. You can end a life without ever being endangered. Even still, we always choose to change someone's heart instead of harming them. It's part of the Phantom Thieves Code. That's right. Kind of pointless if we gotta stoop to the bad guy's level to take him down. Oh man, I guess you guys are right. We never kill. We steal the desires of the wicked and make them change their ways. Yeah, but the thing is, is that we do it to their shadows. I wanna do it to the real people. Mm -hmm. That's why we're the Phantom Thieves of Hearts. Phantom Thieves of Hearts. I've got it. Hearts. I lack a heart. That's why I don't understand the logic of the Phantom Thief. It's okay, I'll go rip one out and give it to you. If only I could understand how hearts work. And it's not the hearts that are being created as pigtails for you either. If I did that, I could become an even better companion. Rocky McDaniel, welcome to Mini Boss Dude! Thank you so much. Sophia? I've got it. I will join the Phantom Thieves. Yay! I need to learn more about hearts so I can become an even better companion. May I join the Phantom Thieves? Of course! If I do so, I am certain I will witness many things about the human heart. I need to learn more about the heart and about the Phantom Thieves. You're already one of us. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you for joining, Sophia. Welcome to the Phantom Thieves. Glad to have you with us. Let's pick our code name next. Ooh. Ooh, now the nostalgia's flowing. Yeah, wow, what kind of code name would she be? No, I don't know. Snowy, Sophie, Mochi? I don't know, Sophie? That's basically her name. I know! <laughs> You do? I want to be Sophie. So basically, we changed her A to an E, and that's her Phantom Thief name. Then you'll be Sophia in this world, and Sophie in the metaverse. They're essentially the same name. Radical, dude. She's adorable. I want two of them. <laughs> Jeez, you're already more human-like than when we first met you. I am constantly learning things, thanks to the internet. I'm learning more words as I speak. Where on earth in the internet did you learn radical, dude? Don't pick up any off-putting lingo, okay? Oh my god, what if, what if she picks up like angry Scottish accent? Oh, little Sophia becoming an angry Scotswoman. <laughs> the 
Okay, so we got a new member. Now we need to come up with our first mission. We're going to stop Alice. Good. This feels like our duty, considering we became phantom thieves to help anyone suffering. I was one of those people once. We may not know the victims personally, but it would reflect on us poorly as phantom thieves to not lend a helping hand. As long as there are people in trouble out there, we won't turn our backs on them. That's Suri Suri. Thank you so much, dude. I've been a long time looker. Loved your reaction to Persona 5. Watched when I was at a toxic job and depressed. Each video helped me make me smile. Glad to support. Thank you so much. That's great to hear. I'm glad to help you. You're right. We are going to be the ray of light for everyone. That even includes Alice. I have registered myself as a phantom thief. All right, the Phantom Thieves are back in action. I can feel a strong bond with my friends. Oh, so instead of... Whoa, wait, what? The bond feature has been unlocked. As the Phantom Thieves deepen their bonds, they will acquire various bond skills. Bond skills can be purchased with bond points by navigating to bond on the command menu. Bond points are acquired by raising your bond level. The bond level increases through socializing events in the real world or by fighting battles in the metaverse. Our next step is to make the proper preparation. So basically, it's like social links, but done differently. That's cool. It's a fact that provision is prevention. We'll all need weapons and other supplies. Since you're the guy with all the connections, we'll leave the shop into you like always. Oh goody, here's one problem. A Y is gone! We'll get ourselves ready. Once you are too, just hit us up. Hey. Okay, let's get our supplies. Let's say we start with the closest destination and head to Takumi Medical Clinic! Her medicine sure worked wonders for us before I've been- We get to go see legs for days! Sorry, boss man. Gotta go. But, but, but come back. I, I made you coffee. Ah! Wait, what? <laughs> no. Don't tell me that she's gone too. Is this the inter internal clinic you were talking about? Yeah, but there's a nose here. No, Close for the summer! I will be attending an academic conference that will be out for the summer. No! Ah, at least we get some. No, I already checked. He was gone. If that's so. Is that the shop of the subtle sheet Shibuya? I saw it while we were gathering information on Alice. Yeah, that's it, all right. Either way, let's head to Shibuya first, Kagado. Uh, oh, oh, that's my quick travel now. So that's my quick travel. I was wondering what was going on, but uh, quick travel cannot be used at this time. The return of the Phantom Thieves is one thing, but never in a million years would I have expected to actually fight Alice. Anyway. But we have to stop her before she's past the point of no return. Let's get this taken care of so we can get on with our summer vacation. Hey. Here, take it. My treat. It's a can of Manta. Just a little something to start us off, start us off right. Here's to get back in action. <laughs> I might be a bit out of shape right now, but I'll bounce back in no time. Thank you. Oh yeah, he's right. Unlucky bond skills. Bond is now accessible from the Bon 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 Bon. Certain skills are like my level cap. Gotcha. Bon Bon. That must be where Makoto. There's Makoto. All right, so now everybody's there. I've been thinking that jail. It was eerie, just how similar the palaces it was. 
It was similarly created by the human heart. I can't help but shiver at the thought of how that person sees the world. Did it upset you? Not quite. Actually, it's rather the opposite. To actually bear witness to such a warped mind is very stimulating. You sure do march to the beat of your own drum, Yusuke. I'm relieved to see your personal troubles are well behind you. No. I'm still rather plagued with problems. The suffocating heat refuses to see my attention and allow me to focus on my art. Even stripping bare naked doesn't abate the intensity. But Despite my concerns of heat stroke, I cannot afford air conditioning. My sole saviors are tap water and the salt stuck pile I maintain. But I shan't let summer defeat me. My frugality cannot be stopped. <laughs> Please don't die on this, Yusuke. All right, well, I now recall your attic room also lacks air conditioning, Kato. In that case. Here, this could benefit you at some point. You don't need to be modest. Rock salt. He's surviving on salt and tap water, yet his frugality will not be stopped. Oh dear Christ. Oh God. Oh God, he's gay. Oh God. Oh, uh, why is not here? Oh, why is gone? We already know. Hi, yes. It's the door to the velvet room. I may need her assistance again. I should probably go talk to her. Yeah, but I should go to the Velvet Room. Oh, oh, okay. Velvet Room first. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Hi, Lavenza. The gears of fate turn yet again, bringing you close to calamity once more. Yeah, I kind of started picking up on that. While your hope may be the smallest of seeds now, and its true power unknown. By nurturing the possibilities within you, this seed shall sprout and become your strength against calamity. Now, I shall act in my master's stead and watch over you through your journey. Yeah, about that. Where is Igor? Ah, let's get down to business yes, to defeat the Huns. I share the sentiment. As you already know, your power of the wild card allows you to wield multiple personas. You know this. By offering up your personas for execution, you are able to fuse them into new, more powerful ones. Oh, they left in the fusing mechanic for this game, thank God. This is once more the key to overcoming the evil will spreading distortion. Due to my master's absence, I will perform the executions with my own personal fusion equipment. Unfortunately, this means you will be unable to harness the power of personas you once harbored within you. However, this journey is sure to draw out your true potential should you make the most of your meetings. Meetings? <laughs> Soon it will all be clear. Okie dokie. Trickster, you have once again become a prisoner of fate. Unleash the chains that bind you, and take back the people's hearts, their desires. Doing so will surely lead you to the hope that will drive off the impending ruin. Uh, I don't have a choice, do I? <laughs> <laughs> don't give me that smile! As long as your will is undeterred, I too will hold nothing back in supporting you. With that address, let us turn at once to Persona Fusion. Oh god, don't tell me I'm going to... <laughs> no, I'm gonna get Gremlin in a jar again! In the Velvet Room, you can fuse or strengthen your personas. This will continue to create more powerful personas. Use two personas to gain a new one. Using personas. Use the number of the personas you currently have to create a new persona. Personas used in the fusion will be lost. In order to fuse a given persona... Joker's level must be greater than or equal to the Persona's starting level. For tips of fusing, yeah, yeah, yeah. Please yeah. select the Persona to acquire. Wait. I 
can't do our send. Are you on? It won't allow me to even choose our send. It seems that it can gain new power. Choose which skill to. Interesting. During Persona Fusion, it is possible to pass on a number of skills to the new Persona. Be aware that depending on the Persona... Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's see. Lunge, Garu. Uh, temporary decreased defense. Yeah, is that's probably handy. Is this the Persona you'd like? Sure. Be born anew. Oh! Iron Maidens! Bicorn. Thank God my first fusion is at least something more interesting than Gremlin in a jar! Impure motives are what grant me strength. Here, take care of this mask for me. Yay! You've tapped into a new power. My God, this is all coming back to me. <laughs> No, no, no. Back. Unless you acquire new powers, the journey that I wish would become impossible. What am I doing now? Are you unable? You wish to strengthen it? By spending persona points, you can level up your persona. Be aware that personas can only be leveled up as far as Joker's current level through this method. As you progress through the story, you'll be able to strengthen your personas in ways that other ones. Gotcha. Okay. Persona points. Ah, watch me learn how all this stuff works. Persona points are obtained through either picking up the mask of the persona you're already carrying, or through fusing or releasing personas. Uh -huh. are you unable oh, I gotta are you do unable it! You wish to strengthen it? Alright, let's strengthen up our set. How much power will you add? Oh, I got lots of persona points. This is what you've chosen. Sure. All right. There, your persona has grown, and this process can be repeated to draw out further powers. One way to consider a persona uh, is that it is your other. Yes, we know okay. this. All right. All right. All personas you previously registered can be summoned for a fee. Yes, I know this. You wish to browse the entries? What will you be registering? Will you register? This person. You have no personas to re. Please take a look. Alright. Jack and Lantern, Pixie, and Bicorn. Well, uh. Is this okay? Yeah, sure. You may take it with you. Might as well get him. Is this okay? You may I take mean, it I with mean, you. I mean, literally, might as well go on ahead and have him. And I got plenty of points. You wish to strengthen it? How much power? This is what. This is what. There we go. Okay. How much power? This is what. Okay. All right. And now I got four personas. Whenever you feel the need for more. Come visit me at any time. I will always be by your side. Until next time. Farewell. Whew. All right. Seriously. Hey, you were out oh, for a second there. Are you holding up okay? I hope you're not overheating or anything. The wise shop is just up ahead. Let's get you inside pronto. Yeah, it's closed. Everybody I knew would love her gone. Hold on. Oh, I should be here, but it looks like they're closed. Looks like that temporarily closed sign's been up for a while, too. What should we do? Not getting medicine is bad enough, but if Y's not here, we can't get any weapons either. Let's head back. Let's we'll figure something else. 
Let's gather the others and brainstorm in the block. All right. Uh, what was the, oh, yeah. This is now the fast travel. The airsoft shops closed. Takemi Clinic's shut down for summer vacation. Where are we going to get our weapons and medicine now? Talk about shitty timing. I know, right? This is not good. We can't just return to the metaverse defenseless. I guess we gotta find some other stores. And that seems like it'll take quite some time. What's up? Have a problem? Actually, yes! Perhaps I can help. If you would like, I'm happy to lend a hand. Oh yeah, check this out, Sophia. We need supplies to take with us into the jail. Unfortunately, our usual suppliers are closed. This will assuredly impact our successes in the metaverse. Do you know if there are any suitable stores nearby? Why not just order supplies online? We could do that, but the delay between ordering and actually getting the stuff is way too long. Also, we were able to get much more effective medicines from our clinic than we could find online. No prop. The net has it all. Ryuji, is there something you want? Huh? What do I want? Right. Request anything you want. Uh, okay. A gold bar. <sighs> really? Really? Don't be ridiculous. Ah, come on. It was just a joke. Nothing else popped into my head when she asked, so... Okay, I've got it. Please wait. Hmm? Got what? <laughs> what? <laughs> got what? Hello? Expedited delivery. What? I'm sorry. Pardon me, what? Really order a gold bar? Uh. How ex? What? I get back super UPS. Whoa. Ha no. How did somebody get the order? Get the thing. Put it in the box. Seal the box. Label it. Give it to somebody for delivery. Drive down. Drop it off in five seconds. Well, someone should open it. UG, this is your doing. Open it. What me? Uh, is this even legal? Well, of course. <laughs> Wait, it is, right? Shit, this is probably just gonna be fake or some toy. Uh, huh? Is that real? Huh? Holy shit! What have I done? <laughs> yes, my eyes can't be fooled. There's no doubt. That's real gold. Okay. Um. Two questions. First question. What? Second question. What? No way. No way is that real. Hello. Now I can open my cafe early. It's like a dream. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is happening? to go to the police right away oh wait they even believe it showed up like this is this a crime hey, my it's okay everybody all right did that solve your problem it created more questions <laughs> how did you do that that was fast good job don't praise her i will praise my daughter all i want you goddamn thug! Yeah! How you like that? I found an online vendor with expedited delivery. Time is no longer a concern. But expedited <laughs> Ha <sighs> Expedite 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 But a whole gold bar? Where'd you find that? The dark web? Uh. Correct, Futaba. It's fine. I broke no laws. <laughs> How was it paid for? <laughs> the transaction was made with cryptocurrency. I, 
will send you an invoice for reimbursement. We have to reimburse you. Which what? So, uh, how much did this cost again? It's a gold bar. I'm pretty sure it's worth at least Ryuji's life. At least a few million. Oh, God. Send it back. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't get that. Send the other thing back! <laughs> Hello, expedited pickup. Thank you for choosing our services. Who are you? I'm relieved they took it back, but. Tanaka, is this your doing? That definitely gave us some gray hairs. Jeez. Thanks a lot for ordering that, Ryuji. Look, Ryuji was not actually thinking that was actually going to happen. I wasn't thinking that was actually going to happen. Oh, come on. Who would have thought a gold bar would actually show up here? Exactly, in five seconds. I've heard of one's mouth writing checks that cannot be cashed, but this is an entirely new level. Doesn't the service itself seem pretty awesome, though? Cool! Yeah, fine, fine. That speed, it'll be perfect for anything we need. Let's ask Sophia to find some useful stuff for us. Shall I do that? Sure, why not? Bye! Sounds great! Okay. I'll make sure to use expedited delivery. Thanks, John Manahan. Sophia's shady commodities, no canning. Sophia's shop is officially open. Okay. <laughs> At Sophia's online shop, you can buy and sell weapons, protectors, accessories, and items. The shop's inventory increases via story protection. Progression. Or after certain events, make sure you're well stocked before entering a jail. There are also shops with some goods that aren't found online, which we have snow. Oh, we, we've seen. Keep an eye out for good deals as you explore the city. <laughs> Score better deals in some Asia. Well, that was a ride, but I guess it turned out okay for us. <laughs> yeah, our supply situation's definitely fine now. <sighs> okay. We don't know what we'll be up against in the jail, though. Let's prepare as well as we can. Oh. Hey! Be right up. Hideout actions. At the hideout, you can infiltrate the jail. Use Sophia's online shop and access the velvet room. Other features will become available as you progress through the story. All right. So... I'll just add this. <clears throat> we have done a lot today. Um, <coughs> I think we're going to end it on that, though. It's 10 after 2 a.m., and we have done a lot today, and I have a feeling that uh, when we get into it, we're going to be going through a palace. So there's going to be a whole lot of fighting and a whole lot of fun. So, yeah. This, at this moment, we're going to have to call it here. So, oh my god, this was incredibly successful. Over 230 people are here right now, and... I think there was even more earlier. So, holy crap. I think I might continue to just stream this because this was massively successful. I'm so glad that so many people were here to watch this. So, all right. I'll keep on, uh, I'll keep on keeping on. So, uh, yeah, this is great. So, uh, tomorrow I might not be able to do this. Um, Monday night, possibly not as well. So, in the next couple of days... Well, oh, it will be very soon, within the next few days. I will at least say that much. I definitely want to get back to playing this as soon as possible, though. So I will, of course, let everybody know via YouTube when there's a stream coming. So I'll let you all know. Anyway, this is Kagato. I am the final boss. Thank you all for joining me. I'll see you again next time. Good night, everybody!